I'm having a gay old time. It's your boy, uh, Joseph Rothschild, a.k.a. MBT. Woo, got this piece of hair. It won't go nowhere. I got this piece of hair. It won't go nowhere. But guess what, motherfucker? Today it's going in the garbage because I'm getting a haircut. I have to. I can't, I can't do another day without a haircut. I have to get a haircut today. I'm going to see if I can plan it around this mechanic. Hmm. How much do your haircuts cost? Uh, thirty dollars. <laughs> Here, give me a sec. Hey, don't. as weird as haircut politics. I don't like how much you have to work to get a haircut in this once great nation. It's uh, too much. I, li I literally said 30 so that CJ could post that. All right, so here's the deal. We're getting the ban list today, all right? We're getting we're getting the fucking ban list today. All right. We're getting the ban list today. 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 Let's watch this beforehand, though. Hundred identical sister. Woohoo, baby! Oh, I get 99 bomb gels for my head up. As long as you leave me one. <laughs> what game is this? This isn't a real game. MBT has a nice bussy. What is it called? It's a racing... It's a biplane racing game. Jesus Christ. Go bald and stand with Gage's hairline. Also, no ban list for at least a month. They're going to let Master Duel cool down. No! There better be one now. A gift. I've never seen this game in my life. What the fuck is this? Freaky Flyers is the name of the game. All right, let's listen to King Scarlet's Master Duel song. All right, here we go. Hey, Master Duel dropped. Let's hit it. Some people tell me that I might have an addiction, but I think I just happen to be overly committed to supporting my favorite personal big business, playing virtual card games like the Lord intended. Master Duel, Master Duel, everybody's downloading Master Duel. As soon as I saw it, I walked around my whole house scrambling for my wallet. It turns out I'm often losing my wallet. It's a huge problem, and I guess I should probably solve it. But anyway, I'm the type of guy to walk into Target, find a piece of fake wood, and spend eighty dollars on it. You can call it gotcha, you can call it what you wanna call it. But if Konami made it, gobble gobble, going down my gullet. Master Duel, Master Duel, everybody's downloading Master Duel, Master Duel, Master Duel, paying more money to do what I did all. Gonna finally know my name. Hey, it's uh, Konami ID 010. And also, King Scarlet was here. That's a good, there's a good one. Master Duel is finally. Oh my god, she made a second Master Duel video. Alright, this is dire. It's called The Importance of Master Duel. Alright, let's 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 get a prediction going. I'm gonna banish a light in the dark. Let's get a prediction going. Will she count to four? Alright. 
I'll give you 30 seconds on this one. out after being just a week away for the past year. Being able to finally play it feels unreal, and nothing's ever gonna be the same. Nothing's ever gonna be the same. Let's talk about it. Strike! Really appreciate it. Oh! He asked himself! If I'm not in this, I'm gonna be mad. What the fuck? Uh, it, it, oh! Gage made it in? Oh, oh that was me, actually. Uh, he asked himself! What the fuck? This is me. Gage has never read Magical Meltdown. And then we're gonna pass it back to my opponent and they're gonna die to their own dark contract in the draw step. We're playing around, uh... We're playing, we're playing around, uh... We did some bullying. Uh, we did a little bullying. <laughs> Danny made it in! <gasps> oh my god. Susu got mirror forced. Now, this isn't going to be a review on the game or how free to play friendly it is because that's all kind of obvious. What we're going to talk about today is how Master Duel changes Yu Gi Oh! forever. Now, there's been online simulators for as long as Yu Gi Oh! has been around, from the official like Yu Gi Oh! Online in 05 to the fan made like YGO Pro. Oh my god, I, I've actually never played Yu Gi Oh! Online. For as long is as Yu Gi Oh! has been around, like? from the official like Yu Gi Oh! Online in 05. Oh my god. No, no, no. This is literally just Edo Pro. Wait, is Edo Pro built off the Yu-Gi-Oh! Online software? This is legitimately exactly just Edo Pro. Five to the, the fan made like YGO Pro, and it's the same software. And even to the manual simulators like Dueling Book, the need for online Yu-Gi-Oh! has always been there. So, what makes Master Duel so special? While YGO Pro and DB have the benefit of being completely free, they both have their downsides. With YGO Pro not having a usable rank ladder mode, and while DB does have that, being a manual simulator is a big barrier of entry to the more casual player, making the game a bit geek. Oh man, Edo Pro used to have a ladder. Whom's tier remembereth checkmate? Whom's tier remembereth checkmate ladder? Hmm. I miss checkmate. I have offered the Edo Pro devs a large amount of money to finance checkmate ladder too. And they were like, nah, it's like a coding issue now. And I was like, well, I tried. Keep you where if you want to play a rank mode, you need to know the game, but how can you know the game without playing it? Master Duel, by having both a rank mode and being automatic, allows for Yu-Gi-Oh! to receive the breath of fresh air it needed, allowing for new players to slowly come to understand the game, bringing forth a new generation of top players, people entering the game who we might not have ever seen. The next Jessie Cotton will get her start in Master Duel, and the text- The next Jessie Cotton will get her start in Master Duel. People entering the game who we might not have ever seen. The next Jessie Cotton will get her start in Master Duel. Dio is going to be the next Jesse Cotton. And the text brought to the game because of the new wave of players will revolutionize the way we see the game. While bringing new players to the game is important for the longevity of not just Master... Love this clip in the background. Revolutionize the way... All right, really cool evil twin we setup. See the game. While bringing new players to the game is important for the long... Draws lightning storm. Longevity of easy. not just Master Duel, but Yu-Gi-Oh! as a whole. That's not all Master Duel does. YGO Pro and Dueling Book are very bare bones, which for non-profit fan -made projects is completely acceptable. Them even existing in the first place is more than was ever expected out of them, but Master Duel being an official product holds it to a higher standard than the others, and it not only delivers, but it excels. Oh yeah. The Nibiru animation is the best thing in the game. By having the game be visually appealing, it allows- Oh! Are we gonna get a chat? Here it is. Here's the- the- the opportune moment. Here we go! for people not knowledgeable about Yu-Gi-Oh! to watch others oh. play and try and get them invested. Again, tying back to bringing oh. new players to the game. Not only is it visually appealing, but it's so easy <clears throat> to follow through visual cues. For example, while my opponent comes off, their powerful cards are- slamming onto the board to signify their importance to the game state, literally making all the other cards shake in their presence, only for me to summon a mirror whose summoning animation is literally it falling onto the field before it destroys everything. Now, I'm no expert in human thinking, but if you ask someone who doesn't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh! what just happened, they're gonna tell you that the meteor crashed down and killed the board. The That's use true. of visual indicators is so, so, so important and well done. Even outside of the visual cues, the satisfaction oh. of slamming your important cards down makes the game feel fun to play. You feel like a duelist out of the anime slamming 
lay me down with your boss monster. You feel you unstoppable. It really makes you feel like Spider-Man. It's weird because you'd think when you are stopped, the fun would stop, but that's not the case. Now, this next point can only go so far. Obviously, if you draw an unplayable hand and your opponent full combo hand loops you, it's going to be aggravating. But for the most part, the small touches of Master Rule make even when your board is broken and your opponent is in a winning position feel fun. It feels fun because you're seeing them show off their power, slamming their cards around, as opposed to doing mm -hmm. a book where, oh, cool, I'll just slide my Zeus out on the board. Like, just look at the comparison between he just slides between these two right here that should speak for itself a more minor point is it gives you stuff to do while your opponent's playing i personally think there should be more to do but what we have is fine whether penning yours or your opponent's mates or messing around with their fields it provides stimulation for your bored little brain while your opponent sets five and stimulation for keeping the player engaged and tricking us into having fun while playing Yu Gi Oh is key because if we're bored while we're playing we're never going to pick it up again having us enjoy the worst the game has to offer brings the game's appeal to the mainstream no <laughs> oh. Who are these people? Now, there's nothing wrong with being a casual fan of something. Casual fans are a majority of the player base. I'm a casual fan of Smash Bros. I will never be competitive, I just enjoy the game for fun. So I'd be a hypocrite if I acted like people who are into Yu on the more casual side were less important. Casual fans they being are. brought into the game because their favorite YouTuber or streamer is playing or talking about the game is so good for- Who here is a casual player whose favorite streamer is me? Uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> if your favorite streamer play Yu-Gi-Oh, you probably play Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay, I guess. Oh, I guess I spoke too soon. All right, never mind. The community. It brings outside perspectives. People like Point Crow talk about. I guess about none of you play Yu Gi Oh! That explains the, the things that you're always telling me in chat. In the game. This brings eyes to the community and hopefully other Yu Gi Oh! It was crazy that Pat got Carl Jacobs on his channel, by the way. So we get more subscribers. <laughs> Good segue. Please subscribe. Some people have even become members of the community themselves, whether it be Swakage regularly being in calls with Yu Gi streamers and hosting tour. Well. Swag's been in the community, though. Tournaments were critical doing videos with Farfa. These big figures in the online entertainment world are noticing us and bringing their audiences along with them. Come on. Critical, hit me up. I'm a longtime fan. And with bigger audiences come- I was a fan back when you had that weird fucking Dark Souls Avi. I was a fan when you had the chopper as an Avi. ...more popularity. Back in the early days of Twitch, Hearthstone was the most popular game. Do you remember this, by the way? Disguise Toast is now this, like, weird lifestyle streamer. But Disguise Toast got his start doing Hearthstone meme videos. Like, Quantal Think style shit. And then he went to a tournament and played Freeze Mage with this mask on. And he won the tournament. It was just like a... It was just like a, a fucking a tournament at a con or whatever. But this was enough. Some well-known streamers like Disguise Toast even got their start there. And I don't think I'm too far off in saying that Master Duel is going to recapture that, but with Yu-Gi-Oh. And that's a wonderful thing. For the past four years of my involvement in the community, I never thought something like this would happen. I remember Farfa hitting 500 subscribers. That was a huge, impossible goal. Over the span of like three months, he was trying to hit. And now with Master Duel, he's hitting 3k views on the daily. Not just him, MBT, Coder, Pack, Gage, all of them are getting a viewer boost. Gage, she is playing the Gage clip again, where he gets owned by me. The entire Yugi streamer community, even Duel Link's meta, who's more Duel Link stuff, he's playing Master Rule. Everything is coming together. This is a beautiful Everything. thing, and I'm so lucky that I get to be part of it. If you watch this video without playing Master Rule, give it a shot. It's free to download, and I haven't spent a single cent on the game, and I have like two decks I've been playing. This game is really special. Konami knocked it out of the park. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out, or supporting my Patreon and joining my Discord. I'd really appreciate it. All right. Sorry. Doubters rewarded. She only counted to three. <clears throat> Every Yugi tuber about to rocket straight out of poverty. Let's go! Oh, speaking of that, let me see if Vlad finished the video. Hmm. I don't see a video from Vlad. Oh, he's online though. <clears throat> Man, yo, Chaotic Meatball, when is, um, when is Brilliant Diamond out? Is it this weekend? Oh, fuck. It's fucking Friday. Man, I wanted to play it for Alt Thursday. I know that it's, like, a terrible idea to do because, you know, like, I should be playing Master Duel. But, man, I really want to play it. There was a four. There was not a four. Not Brilliant Diamond. Yeah, Legends Arceus. 
I've been seeing some uh, preliminary reviews. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. They're looking real good. <laughs> okay, you keep saying she, but others I have heard say he, and I say Z, zero pronouns on their Twitter. Dyer literally in chat. Dyer, am I misgendering you? I'm sorry if so. I'm a girl. Easy. Literal 100% win rate on pronouns. I am undefeated, you fucking dorks. Here, you ready? I, I'll show you how I knew. You ready? Okay, ready? This next point can only- MBT Here. has a this nice easy. Bussy. So Dyer is wearing pink clothes in this, right? And girls like pink. Chaotic Meatball, thank you for the five. Oh, I... Can I play it at that time? Because <clears throat> I might. All right. Now, yesterday, uh, Dyer pilled me on Generator. And I'm going to be I'm gonna be real with you. I was thinking about it all night. I went to bed and I was like, we could do better. I'm we could improve this. Though. I've been thinking about how we can do better literally all night. So I, I'm excited. Okay. So first off, we take out the infants. <laughs> That was the first thing I was thinking. Garbage, low impact hand trap. Second, we cut two lopter. Why are we playing three lopter? We need one lopter, maximum. <clears throat> Third, we play metaverse. Fourth, we cut all of the generator cards. Let me check my generator list right. post ecto. Time for my funny... Okay, here we go. Let's see what I built. Alright, time for my funny Yu-Gi-Oh sketch. So I... Oh, dang it. God, I hate this apartment. That apartment did suck. Well, can't film with the lights out. I guess I'm gonna have to go get the... Generator. Man, I used to really just accept anything for intros. Good afternoon, Jank Enthusiasts. Articles. Oh. Hmm. <sighs> this was back when we were doing the long ass VFD line that we can't do anymore. Damn. Not your finest work? This was this was a fine deck. I played exactly this deck to a top eight in an APS tournament. This literal this weekend. The weekend that I uploaded this. <sighs> no, Chad, I can't do it because the combo is this. You normal summon um Gearsu, use its effect to summon a token, token into Link Karibo. Uh then you go into Um What's her name? Uh Lieb. You leave for uh, Gearsu back, Link Cross, get two tokens, uh, tribute a token for Link Haribo, and then it's like the token. Oh no, you you would you would leave for Monstrosity, and then it was like the token, and uh, I don't even remember. It's all monsters Here, and made on. it promise of set three and a lister combo. Are but ironically, sir and blow. I know I make it at least once copy of har afterwards and three then going to it with Appaloosa we'll negate Appaloosa and a ball maybe I don't make it at all and against El hmm oh right you would ser search armor you would search fucking world legacy armor yeah, you would search World Legacy Armor, then you would make Purple Trish, then you would activate Monstrosity. That was it. Damn. But we can't do that because... No Link Cross. Damn. 
There he is. Use Monstrosity with Macaba. Then I have to open Alistair plus. No, then the, it competes with my normal. All right, so let's let's think real quick about how we would build this. I remember really liking triple uh, boss fight. Uh, I remember not disliking boss state or boss uh, room, and I think I have to play boss room given how much bullshit is in this format. Uh oh boy. Really, I hate Room so much. I'm not a huge fan of Room either, but I, I feel like we just lose so bad to Ash and to Maxi that we probably have to play it. Does Winda clash? Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, by the time you would Winda, you have filled your entire board with tokens. Do we like Alistair? That's what I have to ask. Do we actually like Alistair? Condemned Witch is funny, yes, but it competes for the normal with Alistair. You don't like him? What if instead of Alistair we run the Synchron combo? Play the synchro version? What's the synchro version? What are you talking about? I also don't like this amount of guys, right? I would cut an Ecclesia, I think. 2-1-1 one, one on the Ecclesia? That seems better. It's the Jet Synchron combo, but you activate stage at the end. Okay, I am no longer interested. Have you thought about streaming to YouTube? I am partnered on Twitch. Part of the Twitch partner stipulation is that you do not stream on YouTube. There is an exclusivity clause. Did you know that? It's crazy, right? It's fine, though. YouTube streaming sucks anyway. Oh, my God. I didn't even notice this until it was happening. But a whole shitload of uh, skin just peeled off the bottom of my foot. I, I was exfoliating. Are you... Do you... Oh, man. Do you all want to see the skin that I just pulled off my foot? I'd, I'd really like to show it off. It's really impressive. Getting a lot of yeses and a lot of noes. It's really impressive. Okay, alright, okay. Get ready? Okay. It's, I mean, it's a real... Oh, yeah, we'll do a poll. We'll do a poll. foot i'm gonna banish a yes light in the dark. no okay one minute one minute on this one. Oh my god wow i'm just fucking shedding out here what is going on i mean this is intentional i'm meant to be you know losing dead skin off the bottom of my foot but this this strikes me as too much this is a lot it's also weird because one foot has this happening and the other just doesn't have anything happening nope i spoke too soon never mind all right here we go view results oh there's no way oh yes is or yes is killing uh tyler trag thank you for the sub 
Lizard person confirmed. Correct. If you all thought I was an Illuminati lizard person, you were damn right. Okay, here we go. Ready? It's so gross. Okay, here we go. Look at this. Look at that. It's like a sheet. Incredible, right? It's literally like three inches in diameter. Oh my god, right? Okay, you understand why I wanted to show it, right? It wasn't just a random piece that had come off. It was like, oomp. It is impressive, you gotta admit. That's what you call three inches? Yeah. It's over, chat. It's over. <laughs> that vote is larger than the number of viewers. You people spent points on this? Oh, yeah. All right, okay. Now, what do we want to spend in the last two slots here? This guy really molting on stream. I'm going to banish a light in the dark. All right, I'm going to ask you a chat. The flow rents. Thank you for the sub. I, I'm going to ask you a question that I, I need you to take seriously, okay? I know Dyer is going to not take this seriously. I need you all to take this exceptionally seriously, okay? Ready? Here we go. Are we playing Dovelgus? He's so bad. I think we have to. Uh, he, I think we have to. All right, so I, I'm kind of liking where this is. We've got Ecclesia, we've got Flirtily, we've got one punishment. I, I think I would maybe like to play one more hand trap. I don't know what it would be, though. <clears throat> Second Mardell over Dovelgus? Why? Why not play Called By? Who said that? Correct. Why not play Called By? Uh, if we play... We should take out Metaverse. I'm thinking Metaverse does a lot more than it actually does for us. This looks a little better already. Uh, let's let's disenchant an SR so we can get that third uh, boss quest or boss fight. I like this deck a lot. I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, we are never going to need the two extra copies of this. We're never going to need any copies of. Oh, of course I can't dismantle it. Fuck off. We're never going to need six cop. What the? Six copies of TG Wonder Magician? I'm never going to need one copy of TG Wonder Magician. Oh, fuck you. I'm going to banish a light in the dark. We're the generator. Uh, ZZ Gamer 11, thank you for the sub. All right, this looks good. Let's check the extra two, because I think our extra is a little sussy baka. Like, I don't think we need three fucking Macaba and two Purgatrio. I think we would prefer to have, like, VFD, unfortunately. Uh, the second Entis is garbage. What else do we want to have in here? Maybe just, like, access code, just as a guy. Earth Slicer. Please don't be a UR. Oh, it's not. Hell yeah. It is not in the game. What? Where is it? What the fuck? What? 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 MBT has a nice bussy. What? 
Insane Troll 69, thank you for the three. Don't know if you've checked this recently, but there's an event for the PK guy in Duel Links. He seems fun. Ooh. Yeah, I should pick that up. Owned cards off. There we go. It is a super. That's fine. Do you think we should play World Legacy Monstrosity? It seems kind of bad. This is also a lot of nines. I'm trying to figure out if there is a scenario in which we actually want True King of All Calamities. Or Calamities. Yeah, everyone's like, would we have two two level nines on board? In what world are we going to have two level nines on board? That's going to be turn two or beyond. And we're not going to want removal. We're going to want a card that Dark Ruler no more is the board. Like, True King is really, really good turn one. But we're never going to have him turn one. There's really no reason to go into him turn one. Chat, you could just be real with me. Am I coping? Does it sound like I'm coping? Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. We'll 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 make him. We'll make him. Uh, we don't need the second Boral Sword. We don't need. Oh boy. I thought we had three of this guy. We do. This is the super version. We don't need... Uh, we actually might need Rephlesia. That's silly. Unfortunately, we don't need Colossal Fighter. I like him. Oh, we'll never need Barkeon. Barkeon's good in nothing ever. I feel like we're not done with the extra, though. Is it access code as the last card, or do we also want nightmares in here? Zeus. We could also shave Raijin. Could go Zeus, access code. Okay, what actually the cut is Jormungandr. Uh. I'm liking the way this looks. This is closer, I think. I don't think we're going to be able to figure out how what's not performing without playing games though from this position. I think that we've done we've kind of exhausted theory craft. So let's play some, uh, uh, do we need a link too? I think you're right. But what do we take out though? Do you think Zeus is cope? Zeus has got to be cope, right? Yeah. Okay, let's, let's play, um, Phoenix. You think Artemis over Almirage Gardna? Oh, that does net us a spot. Yeah. Thank you. Perfect. That's looking better. Uh, you play uh, Almirage Gardna over Artemis if you're on uh, Maximus, and we're not. All right, let's put it in this one. Uh, the whites. I like the ritual cage. We'll put the gear town bases on here and then the three main cards what are they going to be definitely we don't want it to be boss stage because then the boss music plays the whole time boss stage is on field let's go har macaba what about the third one also har Ooh. alistair 
Music doesn't play for spells, only monsters. Okay, well. VFD, sure. Zeus is still hyper cope. Yeah, I mean, whatever. Suck my ass, dumb fucks. You don't know anything about Generator. You're probably right. But I don't know what I'd... Mm, I do know what I'd replace it with. I'd replace it with a more expanded invoked package. Maybe a Raijin. All right. Is Farfa playing right now? Let's see if we can fight Farfa. I haven't played against Farfa yet. Wait, what the fuck? That was on reaction the whole time? Do we have enough for Hydralon now? Damn, that is five. Another week. One that play. is five. Uh, I'm actually getting Dono walled. Oh, Dark Fiend? Love I'm it. actually getting cringe? Dono walled. Um, I guess whatever we summon now doesn't matter. We just need to not summon the same name. Uh, so let's just go for... I guess we just let the Seer die and it goes to the grave and then it's I'm just... I'm actually getting Dono walled! Or is it? Wait, hang on. Oh we my god. Hang on. Hang on, let's do some thinking. Okay, let me open up Discord. I'll whine at him here. Uh, Beatrice is 685. Our guides in the grave, Seer. That won't be two names, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, so let's go into a Nightmare Phoenix. Pitching Maxi, probably. Let's force out this back row here. I don't need Maxi. Wait, no, if I put Maxi in the grave, then we have Maxi here. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I guess we just don't use Mask uh, Nightmare Phoenix. Yo, Hydrolander oh is God. such a dumb card. <laughs> uh... He's playing against Monarch, too. God. So we can summon it. All right. We'll bother him later. For now, uh, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hit duel. I'm going to open up a room, and we're going to get four people in here, and I'm going to clap you all. Ready? Uh, okay. Here is the room code. 749-361. 749-361. I reserve the right to leave immediately if Farfa notice me. Alright, Passion Nate. Let's make it happen. I'm sorry. Alright. So today I think our goal is going to be to perfect Generator. How's the volume? Do we need it a little farther down? This is a little higher than it was yesterday. In terms of uh, the background music. Tiny bit down? Okay. Ooh, there you go. Better? Is today banless day? Just a week away. Hala in the opener. Uh, I'm, I'm coping. This is actually a crazy hand. This is like the best possible hand we could have drawn. Mardell in the opener. Uh, Sag, but whatever. No big deal. We play Mardell so that... You know what, actually? What if we cut Mardell? Suck my fucking doo-doo! Are you kidding me? Who plays Droll main deck? You are such a little butt baby! Oh my god! And it's not gonna matter. It's literally not gonna matter. Can you believe that? All that bullshit and it's not going to matter. I'm still gonna get everything I want off this turn. I wonder if I even summon the Ecclesia. I think I do. Save Ecclesia IMO. I don't know. I mean. Farfa noticed. <gasps> Sorry, friend. 
But I was always winning this one. Hello? Asks to duel, proceeds to not answer, and leaves. That you- I got Dodo walled! What do you want? Ah, sorry. Uh, <laughs> so, um... What are we doing, Joseph? Are we hosting a little room of ourselves, or uh, are we actually going to do a 1v1? Let's do a 1v1 and then open up a room, maybe. That'd be kind of fun. That sounds fun, yeah. Well, uh, right, sorry, good. Passion Nate. Uh, I got I to gotta dip on you, but I was going to win. You were so fucked. My hand is unbeatable. Ugh. Let me, let me yeah, actually... I'm going to have to open some Roy packs after our duel, just saying. Don't ask why, but I need to. You're doing what? I have to open some roid packs after our duel just now. Whoa, some roid packs? W did you... You can. Did you make a bet with uh, chat and lose? What happened? Uh, no, I said, hey, uh, if Herman subs to me, I will uh, open 10 roid packs. And then before I could take it back fast enough, I got five gifted subs, so... Easy. Easy, got him. Yeah, Herman owned me on Twitter the other day. That's not fair. Oh, Herman owned me on Twitter the other day. Oh, did you? Were you disavowing the uh, Earth insect? I was, and he was like, "I just make Dryden and pass." He was like, "I just make a disruption and pass." And I was like, hey, "You play Zoo?" And he was like, "Well, any deck can do that." And I'm like, "No, they can't." And then everyone in the comments was like, "What about Hieratic Spheres? What about Macaba?" And I'm like, "Okay, yes, many decks can do that. I guess." I guess you were right. I guess you were right once again. <laughs> All right. Uh, Did you I'm get gonna... the invite? No, I didn't. Here. Uh, like oh, there work. it is. No, I, I see it. I just got it. Okay. Um, All right. Guess what I'm doing on stream at some point. Uh, maybe, hopefully, Thursday? Yeah. Uh, wait, this isn't the deck. Uh, here it is. Oh, we're going to play the base deck. Mm-hmm. Um, so hopefully Thursday, uh, we're going to do like a live debate with like moderation and everything. It's going to be Maxi Advocate, uh, Herbert Handlebar versus Anti-Maxi, uh, Hater, um, Ryan Levine. Oh my God. It's a, wow, pretty, it's a heavyweight match, isn't it? That's going like, to be a, a you know, match of champions. Cards. I will say, yeah. I think that there are arguments for Maxi to be unhit. Uh, I think that I have not seen them on Twitter. I've mostly seen like <laughs> Yugi Boomers like... At least Max C gives you a glimmer of hope. I'm like, yeah, okay, asshole. You know you can play it in the decks that are beating your ass, right? If there was a law that you had to be playing a shitty deck to play Max C, it'd probably be fine. That law does not exist. Oh, son of a bitch. This is a bad one. Anyway, let's use Max C. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I, do you really think that, that I'm going to summon? I just really wanted to just, like, do that. What if I just pass here? Won't won't you look the, you. Won't you look the country fool? <laughs> Alright, let's go Wait, what one. Is this you have? Oh, did you actually buy these toys and stuff? Dude, what? I got the skates, they don't do anything. At least like the car like turns around or something. Yeah, the skates are fucking garbage. They're like maybe the worst. Um They don't have an animation. Like they just No, they don't. They, don't. they just sit there. They I, I swear to god they're unfinished. I swear to god they're unfinished. Oh, this game definitely, the more I've played it, the more I felt like it's maybe been like a bit of an open beta. Yeah. Uh, than, uh, so, how does this work? Oh, uh, it, does it just reveal three, six Draco cards? Oh, there, there it is. Yeah, Generator. there it is, baby. Oh, we got everything. Oh, do I pick, do I pick Generator or do I pick Alistair? Wait, was there an Alistair in there as well? Oh, God. I'll pick Generator. <sighs> How do you do this to yourself? Like, why I'll, do you do I'll this to yourself? I'll be a good yourself? player. Yo, Lopter is basically Al Alistair. Okay, so chat, if I fire it here, I get to fire the boss stage and draw phase, but Farfa draws a singular card. This is really funny. I maxied on the wrong turn. Yeah, you should have maxied on my turn. Give you? Uh, depends on when you activate it, but uh, three if you do it right. <laughs> There's no way Maxi draws three off of one boss stage. Isn't that silly? Is it one per token? Uh, no, no, no. Um, so it's uh, the boss stage summon. Uh, they get Lopter. The boss stage tokens, oh, and then the Lopter. Okay. But uh, depending on when you activate it, they can only give you two. So actually, it's completely based. Mm -hmm. Right. All right. We're fine. Uh, I feel like this hand is one card away from being playable. Come on. 
Uh, oh, wait, your silly deck lets me draw cards or something as well, doesn't it? Ha, huh, idiot <laughs> deck. Only if I play it poorly. Sure. So, yes, it will. So, is this deck not just staple run draw? Mine? Oh, yeah, that's like, kind of silly. Yeah, you do, like, dumb, like, things with, like, combos with draw. Oh, like, to, like, fire the trap and then draw you? Ooh, we should do that. That's the next that, thing we're like doing, chat. That, that does? Theoretically, <clears> we <throat> could. All right, if Maxi oh, was just an upstart, this card is it's, it's wild that we're getting it today. I, I remember uh, just a week ago, I was saying it's it's only a week away. I remember just yesterday, we thought it was it was then, but it actually turned out it was today. Yeah. <laughs> so draw phase, what happens here? All right, so I get to activate boss stage here. So if a card is added from the main deck, you can special summon a generator from it. Okay, but does it like chain to something? What do you mean? Like, uh, doesn't it like summon another guy? Like, aren't you supposed to do something in response to it? Oh yeah, like if you Ash Blossom, then this would be the time to do it. No, but like if if you you're supposed to like use something in response to your boss stage, right? Are you asking if I if you maxi here? Did you fucking Oh my god. Oh <laughs> Jesus Christ. You have never read a single card in my deck, you absolute rube. Oh uh, okay, boss rule. What does that do? Discard you can discard one card, your opponent activate effect becomes each player draws one. Nice, That's Maxi. That's literally the effect of Maxi. No, no, you're drawing one instead of two, and also I draw one. <laughs> Wait, where's my? Why can't I summon Lopter? Because I used my Lopter. I did all this to prevent you from drawing one card. I'm so good. <laughs> I'm so good at Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> I don't understand this deck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go. Be my single hey, negate. You just dart bribe upstart. Is that really what just happened? <laughs> it's more like dart bribing desires, I suppose. Yeah, it's still bad. Still, still penis bad. Oh shit! I just realized this is actually very. Oops, this is not a good chat. Uh, let's go with activate Gallus the Star Beast. Uh, watch him whiff, chat. It, it will be as simple as that. <laughs> oh. Taylor. You're, you, this is a Sekka deck, isn't it? Uh, yeah, of course it is. Uh, so what does uh, Attack Har... Attack a Tombor. Okay. So is Har, Har is an, an Omni. Omni. Yeah, Har is an Omni. And if you add a card from your deck to your hand, you send a card from the hand to the graveyard. The, both hard ones. Is. Uh, well, I guess it's time for Yield Faithful. Dude, I love this deck. I can't believe... <laughs> Bro, it's so crazy! Um, wow. Once per turn, during, uh, if your opponent adds a card, da -da, draw a card, make the same one. When a card or effect is activated, tribute two generators, uh, negate the activation. And Mardell is. What does Mardell do? Uh, Mardell uh, searches a generator. That's how I got to the boss stage. So she doesn't like respond to me. No, she's she's me, bad. Right? She's bad. Don't worry. She's bad. Okay. Uh, do I know what else you ser searched? I only know saw you, saw you search boss room. Right? Everything else is unknown. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, I guess it's time to go to the battle phase. Oh, uh, well, you know, we did our best, Chad. <laughs> I think I have just... Is it going to connect? Will we... Yes, it looks like we have fulfilled the summoning condition of a a certain light machine. Uh, when a card effect activated, uh, negate, activate, destroy that card. Okay, so it, it, is, is, it, is, it, it is once per turn, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. All right. So four materials. Let's make... Our slacker magi downward magician. We chat. We should have. Uh, we should have saved boss room. It would be crazy here. <laughs> chat says, "Where's the car? It's all. Is he all right? Yeah, he's fine. All right. Here we go. And it's time for Seuss. I wonder if I just let this resolve. If only yeah, we played three we just... Lopter, it would have changed literally nothing, Dyer. Wow! We go again. Turns out that drawing double maxi has actually fucked me. Ooh, call by the grave. Yeah, in I'll the game, I'll banish a maxi. Yeah, yeah. maxi. yeah I think idea. you should hit maxi. Yeah, I agree. The Dante with no targets. No, no, no! Call by the maxi. 
so that Why do you want me to? There's no way you have the. Do you have Hydra Lander? Is that what you're pissing yourself about? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good morning. Holy fuck. All right, come on. Oh, boy. Two Burning Abyss monsters. What uh, will he make? Into you. Does it matter if I put it up here? Do I want it up here? Let me see. If I mill right. seal, what happened? Nothing. Okay. So it's... It's one Hydralander, one BA for... What's her name? Uh... What do you mean? Fire Fa. Oh my god. You're so fucking good at Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> You're so good at you how did you get this good at Yu-Gi-Oh! I Ow. can't Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. Ah, uh, let's go. Farfa plus snow. I'm liking the way this is looking. Uh okay, so let's see what's in the grave here. Uh we have ten cards in grave. Um, so oh, suppose... fuck, this unlocks the Hydralander. <laughs> <laughs> that is the play. I have to beat Hydralander um, Beatrice. Okay, I could do that. Uh, I can't get to Beatrice, unfortunately. Oh, what else is in his hand? Mascarena. Okay. Do I use you? Let me see. Uh, I need to count. So I'm going to banish one, two, one, two, three, four, five... No, no, no. Uh, 13 minus 5 is 8. So it should be enough for what's his name. Oh, uh, so it's uh, Snow oh, it's Hydra. Anyway. It doesn't even IP matter. Uh, okay, right. let's activate Snow here. <clears throat> We're going to banish a second maxi. And then an amount of random monsters here for 5, 6, and 7. And now, we do not click yes on responding to snow with snow, which I have done before. <laughs> are you are you sure you don't want to do that? That sounds decent. <laughs> All right. Well, that is Mascarena Snow. You called it. So uh, we're going to special summon the Hydralander. There he is. You know. Exactly five in grave. But wait. Wait, what? There's more! Oh! <laughs> suck my ass. At least it's a hard <laughs> once per turn. Wait, is he hard once per turn? No, of course not. Yeah, he's not, right? That's why he's fucked. Okay. Double Hydralander, baby. <laughs> Out of every card I could have drawn off the top of my deck. The uh, best and, and one, baby! Oh my god! <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> um, let me think. Yeah. Do this. Uh, and then we have three, five, six. <coughs> no, that book. No, 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 no. Doesn't do anything. <clears throat> mm. Unicorn spin Alistair. You're right. You're right. I should unicorn spin Alistair. Anyway. That's a great idea. What do you have engraved here? Can you even go for... Oh, yeah. Mardell's Light. And you can just make that, I suppose. You should have gone for unicorn, you know. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck do um, I do here, chat? I literally do not know. Yeah, we invo. make Macaba. We always invo and... Ba, 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 da, 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 da. Is there anything funky I can do here with Mask? Uh, I don't believe so. I don't think there's anything Hydralander mills, which puts a card in my hand. Alright. Mekaba! Oh, Shave. shit! What? <laughs> Motherfuckers banished both my Dantes. <laughs> We're just playing Mekaba Control now. Or a Hydralander Control, rather. Yeah, we don't need BA cards. Okay, in <sighs> response to the invocation, I think I need to activate Hydralander. So that you don't have a monster in hand. Or at least not a definite one. Graf uh, did that resolve? Graf Seca Tour Guide. Woo! And we have to Macaba here. Okay. 
fart. Uh, then I assume if I chain Mascarena with the Hydrolander, it will still negate, right? Yeah. So we have to use our second. Okay, Hydrolander. come on, just get a double. Just get a double. Is that second? Two Farfas. Farfas. Oh! Let's fucking go. Too many Farfas. Oh. Uh, so it's on resolution. Hmm. Are you gonna fucking snow yeah, here? I was thinking. You go Mascarena, a Chain Link 3, Snow, Chain Link 4. If we had the stack like in Magic. Uh, it's nothing it really does, to be honest. But let's use Mask. And, uh, <clears throat> what are we making here? Is it access codes? I don't think so. 43. You go up to 35 to pop it. I think access code is a good play. Sword's a play. Let's go swordy boy. Two, three, and this. Boom! That's the man. Now I just have to beat snow every turn. <laughs> All right, what the fuck do we do from this position? Uh, we can actually go chain link one. Uh, does banishing your Makaba do anything? It gets him off the field for a turn. It's all part of the plan. Pretty You're much on three just, Farfa yeah. in this deck? Uh, no, there's two. Oh, you milled the one, right? Yeah. yeah. Make Underworld <clears throat> Goddess easy. This board does not make Underworld Goddess chat. Much as I wish it did. Ooh, I can chain Alistair to give him a thousand attack. <laughs> you should. Nah, I'm good. Uh, let's see. Let's go with Skarm. Mm -hmm. All right. Do I have any tour guides left? I do, right? Let's go, motherfucker. Wham! Ooh. All right. Why didn't you start with that? Because I. I, I only need one thing here. <laughs> sure. Well, Fusion Destiny isn't in the game, so... Six? I only need one card, baby. Six. I only need one card, baby. Not that one. That's the one. That's the Ball one stage. I'm fucking talking about, baby. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, a Classy is oh. good, too. Uh, no, we got to take boss stage. Am I in danger? Uh, so it happens instantly in the draw phase, right? That's correct. So I can't, like, I mean, I, I, I can just. No, you can't do the... some dumb fucking stupid Hydrolander bullshit. I will not permit you to do so. No, there definitely is, like, Hydrolander, Chain Snow, Chain Macaba, Chain Boral Sword or something, so you can't respond or some bullshit. <laughs> I'm going to chain your ass um... shut, is what I'm going to do. <laughs> uh, okay. So we're going to use Skarm. That's fine. And we're gonna search tour guide. Yep. Guess what, idiot? That triggers on my turn too. <laughs> uh, but it just summons a bunch of tokens, right? Oh, any generator? Oh. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. How do I, I really do want this? to? I could just for, before we go to before Makaba gets to negate on my turn, I can just force out Har <laughs> with a snow. I think. Farfa resolves. Wait, shouldn't you get your tokens first? Uh, tokens are Wait, only on your okay. turn. Okay, draw phase. Let's see here. Um, you're activating boss stage. <laughs> Wait, is this opponent's turn only? Once per turn, quick effect. Wait, why can't, why can't I use Hydrolander? You have two cards with the same name in your graveyard. Oh, so I can't activate it, right? So I'm trying to like resolve it on, okay. So it, it needs to be activatable. So I have to use Snow first, then Boss Stage, right. uh, then Hydrolander. Uh, so what is Utgarda? It is a tribute to, then target a card and field, banish it, quick effect. Why is such a cringe guard there, buddy? <laughs> He's a little he's silly. No, we don't get tokens. <clears throat> All right, so what do we have here? So let's remove some multiples here. So that's a. So we have two Farfa, two Skarm. So let's remove Farfa and Skarm. And then, <clears throat> what else? Let's remove you. 
four, uh, five. I'm gonna banish a six, light in the dark. And probably just get rid of the BAs in case I mill multiples. No, I only play two Skarm anyway. Uh, the graph, I suppose. So I should be able to chain Hydrolander now if I want to. That's correct. Yeah, okay. Uh, no response to this. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, that's fine. Is there nothing I can do with Boral Swords? Uh, you could change a monster like... to defense position. Yeah, but like, you know, like use Hydrolander, chain Boral to like make you not respond. <laughs> that's like, yeah, I can't really do that. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that would be sick, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're letting it work like this. I see. Uh, yeah. So I can force out the Har with Snow here. Or Makaba. What do you have in hand? It's an Alistair, right? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> target this. We're always makaba this. And then we're chaining Hydra. <clears throat> did it resolve? Oh, it did. And then we're always harring this. Yep. Well, that's everything baited out, I guess. I maybe should have like... sent the Artemis here. Yeah, definitely should have. You live and learn. I don't think Graf gets anything, to be fair. Uh, why the so BA no die? <laughs> <laughs> what does Graf have to summon here? Uh, we can burn for 900. Ooh, that's crazy! <laughs> uh, is this guy still alive? Tribute to target a card on the field. You can tribute to generator. Okay, so I think I need to go for... <sighs> yeah, I need to go Alich. You have Alich in here? You're playing yeah. everything, buddy! Oh my god. Yeah. You Alich target oh, a I dare you. Yeah. <clears throat> Not pretty. Not pretty at all. Uh, we should have used uh, the Har tributing the Artemis so we could keep a token and Har <clears throat> could be on field, but I don't know if that really does anything. Okay, time to play the game. Um, All right, time to see how far a single tour guide can get us. Uh, do I want to use that? Let's see. A lot of cards gone from the, from the deck here. Uh, let's go. Yeah, let's normal summon tour guide. Yep. <clears throat> uh, effect. Yep. I, I got nothing at this well, point. You just go off, King. Let's proceed. <clears throat> With Rhino. Realistically, uh, how Rhino much shit can you have? Can send Seer to summon Barbar. Uh, Rhino send the Seer in my hand to summon Barbar. Try to get a draw off this. Seer in your hand. Um, yes, yeah, so let's use this and try draw Hydrolander. <laughs> Are you on three? <laughs> oh, that didn't work. Um, okay, so we go Tribony now. Yes. Boing. <clears throat> uh, we go Rhino. Yes. Rhino sends Seer. Sure. Um, Seer brings you back. <coughs> I'm just getting access and, coded. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't <clears throat> think I have game, though. Hmm, there's no game. I'm getting queer coded. Chat, can we cancel Farfa for queer baiting before this ends? That's, I think, our win con here. Um. No, I don't really have access codes. How, uh, how on earth can that be the case? What is the send? I have nothing left for this. That's the problem. Uh, you should have a. Oh, ooh. Yeah, I <laughs> just scrolled over the banish <clears throat> zone there. All right, well, we'll take seven. Mm -hmm. Banish, banish, banish. 
Ah! I have no access access code. Uh, I don't think I should have second. Uh, I had a seer in my hand, so I should have went tour guide into Libich. Make Tribony, Tribony summon the seer from my hand. We're spinning Macaba uh, here. The seer would be the stuck field. there. Uh, wait, no. Then the seer would make unicorn. Hmm. Two cards and extra chat. Uh, boing. Ow. I think I lose from here. Yeah, I think I win. Let's see what draw. Uh, let's see. I have a Skarm search. We draw Invo. <laughs> yeah, Invo would be a crazy draw, chat. You are correct. Invo, do not. <laughs> I drew the best card in my deck, buddy. Uh, Alistair? <laughs> Pot of Prosperity. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. That's pretty unusable. <clears throat> okay, so you get some tokens now. Yeah. What am I supposed to do about tokens coming back every turn, dude? Okay, we get Hala here. <clears throat> we get a million what that tokens. Do? Could be a generator uh, and target <clears throat> a generator monster or something with different names. Special summon it in defense. Oh, yeah. God. Uh, access code um, really complicates things here. You added Libich, so I think I actually have to Hala for a Garda. But we're fine. So this just targets a card on the field and banishes it. Well, I lose now. How? How? <clears throat> <laughs> Gallus. That is. I will take it. Yep. Ugh! Uh, I make you commit to him, right? Eh. Eh. If you click fast enough, I can't respond. Yeah. So what we need you to do is go on toggle auto and not toggle on. If you could do that for me real quick. <laughs> yeah. Could you toggle off, please, if you don't mind? Yeah, I'm actually cool. All right, show me the tour guide. I only play two. Woo! Ah, uh, Libich. my good friend Libich. Yeah, I, th I should have second the thing. I could have uh, tour guide into the rhino, make Tribony, uh, send Libich special the tour, the seer from the hand, make unicorn, Libich special summons, unicorn plus that into access code, access code banish, a dark hit the field spell, and then attack Makaba. <sighs> and then I don't think you can come back from a dead field spell. Alright, Hydra! Wait, no, you just get more <clears throat> fucking tokens. This is like a one card deck. Like, yeah. what the hell? <laughs> Boss stage is the one card combo. We still lose to Nibiru, I think. Yikes. Uh, yeah, no, I drew a Jackal. That's not going to get me anywhere. Good game, sir! Woo! Invoke <laughs> Generator Best Deck! That was actually a good game. There was a lot of back and forth there. I'm sure. That was, uh, that is why. Uh, Earth Insect is fair and balanced because I drew it and it, 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 <laughs> and it drew you one card. <laughs> Earth Insect, good. You're right. I didn't think oh, about it. Like, wait, you drew you drew right, two I need to go Earth Insect. Packs now. You have to what? I have to go open my Roid Packs now as punishment. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Roid Packs. All right. See you, dude. Have a nice right. stream. You too. What a nice young man. <clears throat> Dire, thank you for the 10 gifties. Generator, too fucking strong. Too fucking strong. <clears throat> okay. Uh, despite the fact that we clapped Farfa beyond all sense of recognition, I think that there was some stuff we learned from that. And that's that I'm bad at this fucking deck. That boss room almost lost me the game. I actually really do not like the Ecclesia stuff. I think I'd rather play just like anything else.
Like, the Nadir looks so hot, but... Davogus is running a Garnet in case you draw a Garnet. The fuck do you mean in case you draw a Garnet? We're playing one, two, three, four, five, five Garnets. <laughs> We're gonna draw a Garnet. No, yeah, Winda's wind is not good in this deck. Because you do it before you summon the tokens, and then uh, then you're fucked. Oh! Yeah, it doesn't really work the way you want. You have to commit to Winda immediately, and then it's just susceptible to everything. And everyone's prepared to beat Winda, so whatever. Droll? No, Droll doesn't really do what we want. We're definitely playing more Lofter. We're not playing Nidog. Are you kidding me? No way. Dystopia package. <gasps> Prosby, please. Hmm. Lone Fire? No, we don't need more normals. We can play Imperm. No, Mech Knights don't really do what you want. The only good one is purple. What is with you people in Condemned Witch? No. Perfect deck building. We're on Prospies. We can't play Upstart. Mm. Triple Judgment. Yeah, I kind of like Judgment. Yeah, I think I like that a lot. How about that extra deck? What are we playing in the extra now that we have space? Well, now that we have space, I think we should probably play uh, Al Mirage. So that we can maybe make it to uh, Christmas. <clears throat> Underworld? Sure. Jorman? Oh, Mask Arena is great. Yeah, Mask's crazy. All right, let's jump into some games. I do have the Magistus link. All right. New duel room, let's go. Uh, all right. <clears throat> Six six five eight one nine. Six six five eight one nine. Six six five eight one nine. Plat one is currently the highest rank. Ideally it will change. I'm sorry. Alright, and it's full. Nyan Piggle, let's go. Do 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 Alright, well, 
we're going first. Not that it really matters. I am pretty sure you can demote from rank one. Oh, this is a perfect hand. This hand is killer. Uh, we go Mardell here, get room. Yeah. Thank God we're playing more than one Lopter now. How did you get a pick of yourself in a Master Duel? You talk about Lopter? No idea. Took a lot of work. I wish that society, if a uh, boss quest let you put back additional generator spell traps. I wish they would buffer plat one because I want to fuck around in ranked. I don't want to have to make these dual rooms, but whatever. I have thought about nine lives cat. I don't think it's very good. I have always felt that card was cope. Uh, because we have everything, we're going to go lopter here. Anther Blatnir isn't too awful. Yeah, no, we're playing Anther Blatnir for sure. Non-targeting Banish? Yeah, you got it. All right, as soon as they take an ap action, we're tagging out for Har. Wow. Well. That is the least impactful super polymerization I've ever seen in my entire life. Respond. Do it. The boy has arrived. I love that he has an animation. He really deserves it. <clears throat> That was, they super polyed a token and my searcher that had already activated. Black Eld Elixir for what? Walk or Conk or something? This is a thinker. So we could go Earth Slicer here. We're always just going to combat here, I think. We could do the Alistair line first, but I don't think it's worth it. If they activate something we goes in match. Do you have to negate that. On fort. Yeah, there's one down. Okay, we'll terraforming here. No IO, that's good. I imagine no IO. Grab magical meltdown. Meltdown. Still resolving. Wakero kind of complicates this. <laughs> oh my god. 
It's just so based. How do you get this based? How do you get this red pilled? You know, etc., etc. Skill drain goes in rivalry. Well, you know, we tried our hardest. <clears throat> so shockingly, I think we are still fine. So these are fairy tokens. Is there a fairy generator? Does anyone know? Dude, fuck off. Lopter? Hmm. I don't think we have like a main deck out to this. Best card in our deck, don't mind if I do. Epic. It looks like everyone else is playing each other. Hmm. Let's watch GCD's game. Epic! Epic! Is uh, GCD playing He's Coming? No. What's the going second strategy for your deck? If I think of one, I'll let you know. Draw Maxi. That's step one. I mean, you gotta respect the drip, right? Playing... Uh, Playing Girgia with the Girgia pet. Okay, so there's Weisel. There's Citadel. There's Metal Cruncher. Citadel. Gear frame, gear frame. Okay. Chalice targeting Citadel. Weisel negate. You've never fucking read Weisel before, idiot? FD fart for dangerous. Oh, it's hero. Shadow mist for Stratos. Stratos effect. Mask change the dangerous for Dark Law. Uh, what do you do if you just Citadel here? What happens? What happens if you just Citadel a resolution of this? You've got a second mask change. Anki? Oh, let's go. 
Actually, uh, let's not go. You're fucked. Hero! Hero's so good, man. That was the equivalent of a Nibiru? Yeah, except it was on the board already. That's my gameplay. I was unaware of what machines do, and I do not read. Oh, we're at live. Well, it looks like it's not going to be your gameplay for much longer. Ooh, got him. Doot doot. Doot doot. Un spare. Metal Cruncher. Citadel. Alright, GCD, let's go. Or or that guy. Knoppers. I'll play I will play anyone. One of you two get out of here. <laughs> Why can't I kick people? <laughs> Beep boop. Yes! See, Chad, we don't need a going second plan if this keeps happening. <clears throat> I'm still thinking about that piece of skin I pulled off my... Oh. Uh, this is fine. Don't got, don't got no generator. Ash here. Why would you ever ash here? I have to call by, even though it shuts off my fucking ash blossom. Boss quest is gonna fuck me up. Statistically, it's 100% incorrect to Ash there. When are you going to fry it and eat it like a potato chip? I don't know. Okay, so this isn't optimal, but it's very funny. This is what we in the business call a advanced BM. My BM is beyond your comprehension. Did you ash your own Alistair? Uh, yeah, Ash is under called by. Didn't you need that for the Makaba discard? Who the fuck said that? Take 10. Absolutely not. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm Alright, can we beat this deck with one negate? One total negate. Yes, we can. I'm gonna banish the lightning. Oh, good. Oh my god, wait. That's actually like the best card in our deck. Farathon, thank you for the sub. Thanks to Prague Playoffs for teaching me about Karakuri, so I felt like I was doing in the solo mode when I had six on board and OTK'd with them. Hey, glad to hear it. Pole position is not legal in Master Duel. It's not only not legal, it's not in the game. They were like, fuck no. What, what are you, pole position? No way. I uh, see a an, an more advanced BM here. Oh, uh, we already have a, uh, a Fire Engrave, yeah. <clears throat> mm, mm, 
Bum bum ba dum bum ba dum bum 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 bum. Mm, mm, mm. Can you prohibition it? I don't. Uh, you should be able to actually. I don't know. That's a good question. I think there's no reason to get Lopter here. Bum, 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 bum. Uh, I think the play against Tiro is actually Utgarda. Is Hela ever a thing? No, we have nothing in the grave. <laughs> Alright, let's see what the best you could do is. <laughs> FD. No response to that. I'm a Yugi boomer trying to return for the real time since Xyz uh, were introduced. Any advice on learning the new complex stuff? I run DDD, Cleefort, and Sky Striker, but I'm struggling hard. You gotta be fucking with me. You're a Yugi boomer who hasn't played since Xyz, and you were like, the first deck I need to learn is DDD? Wow. Oof. Yeah, no, I would bet you're struggling hard. That's a hard one to start on. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess my... Uh, what I, what I would say is it's actually a lot easier to learn, like, a control-style deck with one consistent combo. Uh, I, I would say even screwing around with Invoked on Edo Pro for a couple of minutes will give you kind of a lot of what you need. Oh, fuck. Uh, just in terms of um, giving you a sense of uh, how, like, a, a normal deck plays. Striker, I think, is a good pick, but does require a lot of brain power. Uh, in general, I, I would say just don't get discouraged. Um, DDD is a deck in which you're going to be well served by looking up combo guides. Striker is a deck in which you're going to be well served by just sort of getting a feel for how the game plays. And you are going to have to learn both to like really get good. But, you know, it might take some time. Uh, that was a... Oh, wow, that was a good one. Hmm. <clears throat> Uh, I am negating Ferris, I believe. Uh, you know what? Actually, Ferris is fine. I'll I'll banish uh, the fucking back row guy. <laughs> what? Uh-oh. I didn't know he searched that. Mm. Oh my god, you're right, chat. You're so right. I'm gonna wait for battle, then I'll do that. Because you can't increase in battle. Does Generator have an out to Plasma? You're about to see it, baby. No response to Mally.
Oh, we have to do this. This is like really poopy, but we have to do it. Don't have an option. No more increase. Yeah, they don't have a choice about this attack either. Yeah, they're just dead uh, to next draw step, I think. Yeah, you're right, chat. I, I wasn't thinking. Ouch. That Celestial might be a problem. I think we can just go hard here. Be fine. You like Hala into Utgarda? Yeah. I don't dislike that. We're always doing Hala for sure. <clears throat> uh, you know what? Yeah, you're right. Uh, Utgarda is, is a higher impact card versus Hero. Lopter into Hala into Edgarda. Uh, yeah, probably that was the play. Whoa. Why did it not let me do this? Thank you. Hey, we did it. Wow, what the fuck is their hand? What is their hand? Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Wow. Well, I mean, you got me. I I didn't think you would have it in you, but yeah, go for it. Wow, that is really fucking rough, actually. That's exceptionally rough. Wow. That was like the best possible thing they could have done. They're gonna add a hero here, yeah. They get... No way they get a uh, Ferris number two. Yeah, you have to get honesty. You have to prompt battle here, too. It's, like, kind of poopy. <clears throat> Mask change? Wow, well, okay. I guess I'm guarding here. Uh, if they have, like... There's no way they have something to play around this. Because they set their whole hand. Oh, they have a response. Yeah. I don't know. I couldn't tell you, Snake Helios. If they ever had a response to one of my effects, then we would use it. For sure. Alright, one of the sets has to be Fusion Destiny or they're dead here. The response is honesty. Oh, I see. Didn't even want to eat the, uh, the Purg here. The Pjorg. Oh my fucking god. How did we get so good at Yu-Gi-Oh, chat? See an infip, please? Nope. Do we have lights in rotation? We don't. Oh, we do. We have the other Makaba. I'm just fired here. Dun 
Oh, he's a spellcaster. Oh, watch this. <laughs> no, new ban no no new ban list yet. We've all been waiting for a long time. I don't know when we're actually going to get it. Suck my fucking cock, dude. There's no way. Great tornado. What the fuck do you make here? The shining? Sure. I'm not I'm not fucking around. He has uh, elemental heroes. I can't let him get those. Uh, do you or anyone you'd recommend offer coaching in Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah, I would really recommend coaching from um, uh, Pack TCG. Uh, his availability is pretty sparse, but he's on Metify. Uh, he's one of the best Yu-Gi-Oh players of all time, and he's an ex excellent coach. Really good coach. He streams, too. But his streams are usually him tryharding in tournaments. Chat. Oh, yeah. Chat's great. Um, if you want a specific deck, there are a lot of interesting one tricks. Hey, I want to play GCD or Lamb. There we go. Nice job, Canoppers. Or should I say, c Coppers. Ugh. Anyone from playoffs is also great at coaching. Yeah, buy, buy a Danny coaching. <laughs> Oh my gosh, he does a little rainbow dance. Leah is great at coaching for pulls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. GCD, my head is so cracked. No, wait, he's going first. No! All right. Okay. I'm going to banish a light in the dark. Iron Lung 667, thank you for the sub. Fine, yeah. Go make Gear Gigan X. Teach me a lesson, buddy. Get Beyblade coaching from Danny. Suck my ass, dude! You're so good at Yu-Gi-Oh! How did you get this good? Oh my god. He's crazy. Oh, he's so good. FTK, 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 FTK. Okay, at least we could beat Gear Gear, Rock, Paper, Scissors. Ready? Let's go. Give me another one. Okay, that was a tie. Again. I'm 2-0 and against him. Fuck, that was a tie. 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 A tie. A win. 3-0. and Okay, we got fucked. 3-1. and do the pets do things when you click on them? Uh, the Gear Gear pet plays rock, paper, scissors with you. This is what the Karakori pet does. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. We always knew this was happening. I don't get those weird gang symbols. Sometimes he rolls around. He's not doing it now. Okay, Fortress. Oh, do we have Citadel already? Yeah, okay. Okay, this is the setup. So, a Spell Negate. I'm gonna banish a Light in the Dark. Holy shit, is that Yu-Gi-Oh? I love that game. Dr. Strange Show, thank you for the seven. Yeah, I thought I'd try it out. I know you all are usually here for my um, inscription content, but I thought I would give Yu-Gi-Oh a shot. I know you all are usually here for my Ace Attorney content. I know you all are usually here for my nudes, but I thought I'd give uh, this a shot.
You let it resolve. Ooh. This is hard for sure. I don't think that was the pick. I think the pick was boss stage. I need him to let this uh, resolve. Let this resolve. Let this resolve, please. Oh, thank God. My hand is so fucking poopy bad. Oh, we gotta get boss fight here and boss room. It's kind of counterintuitive, but the stupid ass fucking Weissel. It's gonna really screw me up. I don't see why you wouldn't egg that, because I'm on <laughs> I'm on invoke generator. If I land down boss stage after that, then you get fucked. But uh, I think you probably do. Okay. We can make this work. Citadel at end step. Popping fortress. No response to that, yeah. Trying to think how silly I can get here. I'm going to wait for main. I can do this in battle. I hate the Weissel is a spell negate. Why? There's no reason for it to be a spell negate. Overdrive. We're going to chain boss fight. Okay, a resolution, we're going to activate boss stage. We can get Lopter here. We need this to be the only point of interaction. Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it. I think I was supposed to get Har here, actually. Yeah, we have to actually chain Lopter here because of the way this is going to work out. My opponent's going to get a chance to activate an effect not in chain to my generator cards, which means the boss stage would be offline. So we'll just go resolution Har. Like this. And then boss stage, a bunch of tokens. Is there any deck tracker for Twitch viewers? There's not. Oh, uh, I should, I should, uh, make this a thing. Does YGO Pro deck take Master Duel decks yet? If so, I'll start uploading my builds on there and we can, we can ping them as they go. In fact, let me let me do that now. I'll just put together the generator deck I have in paper. I'll upload it to YGO Pro Deck while GCD's thinking. Mm -hmm. 
Baker's dozen, thank you for the hundred. Please build weather painter generator. Yeah, we can do that. Redeployment. Unfortunately, I think I have to let this resolve. As much as I want to solemn this. We can har here at resolution too. That's kind of killer. Unclas Aspare. And then a card they're going to have to send. Two Unclas Aspare. Okay, that's interesting. Resolution will har. Sends a card from their hander field to the graveyard. Or a monster, rather. Okay, they're letting that resolve. So I imagine they're picking an Unclas Aspare. Specifically doing this. Sending Weissel. Oh, okay. Says, you know, fuck it. I actually don't need Weissel anymore. Oh, now they have to normal. Oh, this is Posesatora. This is storage. I think I actually have to solemn this. Feels very bad. But I have to be able to contest the Citadel at all times. Oh, wow. They drew the, the shit for Fortress anyway. So now they can Citadel uh, to pop everything but the Har. And then contest the Har on the following turn. Oh, they're just doing combat. Whatever. Taking 15, 25 here. We go to 15. That's more than enough. Mm -hmm. Alright. Oh, are we dead here? I wonder if he goes for it. It forces out the har, but... Yeah, I don't think there's a reason to go for it. Like, it forces out the har, but I will har. Oh, Fortress is such an asshole. Okay, here we go. Wow, that's a sick rip. That's an incredible draw. Okay, let's go Alistair here. Alistair resolves a significant amount of this board state. We already have the Mardell engraved too, so pretty decent. Uh, we are actually going to make... Fuck, we don't have Artemis. Shit. One of the very few positions where Artemis would be crazy. Uh, we'll just make um, Almirage here. Almirage does fuck some stuff up for my opponent. We go Invocation here. Ice Dragon's Prison on the Invocation. Wow, that's killer. Oh, I have nothing to negate that with. That's fine. Oh my god, they're both fucking spellcasters. Well played, GCD. That was our... Our first real loss today. We lost to Io, but damn. That was really well played, GCD. Oh, man. Oh, good stuff. All right, I'm going to uh, run a quick ad. If you are not subscribed to the channel, get absolutely dumpstered. Uh, if you like what you see, please consider dropping a follow on the channel. Really appreciate it. Exclamation mark socials if you're feeling exceptionally generous. Uh, it's a link to my YouTube where I'm going to put up some Master Duel content, including me saucing some of the biggest content creators in the game. And uh, maybe, uh, maybe some other stuff, too. We'll see. <laughs> no ban list again.
I don't know what I'm doing. I didn't even start the ad. Okay, be right back. I'm gonna pee pee. All right, gender raiders. Oh. Let's run that shit back. Solo mode leaks. Oh, solo mode leaks are going to be weather painter. Oh, well, then I have to wait. I'm sorry. I would make Weather Painter Generator, but I don't want to waste a lot of money on a solo mode. Blue Eyes, or maybe this is like Pacifist. Uh, Mecha Phantom Beasts and Herald. Okay. Uh, Painter is going to be a very fun solo mode experience. That's Light Sworn? Yeah, sure. I mean, I don't know shit about it. Oh, this is a killer hand. This is, this is an, a very good hand. Oh, wait! We're going second! This hand is ass. This is a pee pee hand. Baker doesn't think of the 201. No! Build now! Can't do it. Game crashed. Let's go. Easy W. Easy W chat. Easiest W of my life. Here, I'll, I'll jump out. Nope. Well, I can't even jump out. Wow. I'm getting dumpstered. I built weather painters two days ago. Tell me how to build them now because I don't know what I'm doing with weather. Uh, it, the I'm idiot's guide to weather. Just check that out. Uh, no, um, it's, uh, pretty much the way you play weather in Duel Links is the way you play weather in TCG, just with, like, additional hand traps. Um, I, I honestly, if it's coming out, I would wait on it. Uh, I think it's actually a lot of high rarity cards. Let me check. Lamb, if you want to jump back in here, it's fine. Diviner art for the solo mode. Oh my god, she is adorable. Chat, look at this. Oh, she's adorable. I want her dead. That's what you get for how much Drytron you've su subjected me to. Ooh, do you think I could cosplay Diviner? No, probably not. I don't know how I would do the wings. I've never cosplayed in my life. I always want to, but, you know, you can't just go online and buy a full cosplay. You have to, like, make it. And I feel like if I make it, I'm not going to do a good job. <laughs> just grow wings. You cosplay as a jar of mayonnaise. Okay. We're going to do Homestuck cosplay? Wait, Danny, can we actually go somewhere in Homestuck cosplay? YCS Vegas will do Homestuck cosplay. MBT Dave Strider, Danny Carcat. <laughs> I don't think Danny can be Carcat. Hmm. This is a a very weird hand. So. This is why I don't like playing Lopter. I'm going to cut a Lopter after this. I'm going to cut it to two. Danny is Dirk. Danny is not Dirk. 
Maxi. Well, now I feel like the decision has been made for us. If anything, MBT is Dirk. That is closer. <laughs> when I was in college, I, I thought I was I'm Dave. I'm going light in the dark. N now I, I think I am, I'm coming around on it. Baker's Dozen, thank you for the gifted sub to Ro Tomington. Danny is like Tavros? Dude, come on. That's so mean. What the fuck? Who says shit like that? That's so mean! Alright, we're gonna keep the Terra so we could fucking melt down again next turn. Danny is Gamzy. He's not Gamzy. Danny is John. How is this hard? Danny's the easiest pick for John I've ever seen in my life. Danny is like archetypally Egbertian. Joseph is like Airy Dan? Yeah, I wish. All right, uh, let's go grab boss stage here. All right, so, I mean, this isn't, like, super great, but it kind of works. I think I'm getting Lopter here uh, just because, like, I want to press the advantage because we, we're not going to be able to win a long game, I don't think. Gavin is clearly Dirk. No, Gavin is... Who is Gavin? Gavin's Riska, probably. No... Who's Gavin? Gage Aridan? Yeah, for sure. Gavin is like... He does some Vriska shit. Sign at mining. Well, now I wish that I had gotten a Har here. Who is Simo? I don't know. Simo's like a normal person. He probably would not be involved in this. Brent is club's deuce. <laughs> I don't know if that counts as being mean or not. Simo is Solix. I almost said that, but I, I can't really identify why, you know. Farfa is Gamsy. Yeah, for sure. That's not close. That's not close. Just a vibe, yeah. Started talking about Homestuck. Lost 100 viewers. Easy. And I'll do it again, motherfucker. Um, Coder is kind of Solix, though. That's the problem. How does boss stage work? Glad you asked. So when your opponent draws a card or adds a card from the main deck to the hand, uh, you can summon a uh, generator from your deck. Uh, we're going to har here. And then uh, if you summon a generator from your deck on your opponent's turn, you summon tokens until your side of the board is full. So what we're going to do here is Har. They have to send a card from their hand to the graveyard. Oh, it's adding Nister. Wow, this is really good for us. Because we have boss fight, we can do it again. So we negate the first thing with Har. We activate boss fight. We get out Garda. And then we can banish a second thing. So we have two interruptions on this board that our opponent began with a maxi. So like they're down one already. And now they're down two because of the Har. God, I, oh, I love this fucking deck. Oh my god, I wish Dyer had never... I wish Dyer had never said this shit ever again. This is rough. This is such a... It's a really, really good... Um, a Garda target, but the way that the tokens worked out, we can't do it here. Backup Secretary. Oh, please, just do something I can har! RJ gives Jade energy. probably what happens if you don't draw boss stage the fuck did you ask me that what what did you just say to me oh my god the fuck did you just say to me you little shit you talking to your mother with that mouth how would we not draw boss stage what are you some kind of some kind of fed what are you a narc get out of here what a stupid son of a bitch all right, that cuts off an extra normal, so that's good enough. Anyway, uh, no, there's 
three boss stage, three boss fight, which gets you boss stage, three lopter, which gets you Mardell, which gets you boss stage, two of the uh, negation tool, or the, uh, the cycle tool, which gets you boss stage. There's like 20 copies of boss stage in this deck. It's almost impossible to fail to open it. I mean, you can. I've done it. Linger. Oh, fuck. Wait, that's still fine because we have room. I'm so good at Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, never mind. It's also fine because that's the end of their turn. All right, the game is now done. Don't stay awake for too long. You stayed awake for too long. Now you must suffer the consequences. I'm gonna swing for the fences. All right, give me the fucking meltdown. We're melting down again. Siberian rabbit dog scratch. No, that's definitely not true. Siberian is easy car cat, right? Like easy car cat. Tanny says yes. If Siberian is car cat, DM me. Uh, me or Siberian? <laughs> They're mad literally 100% of the time. <laughs> That's not true. Uh, Siberian is usually very happy when they enter our um, our progression playoffs uh, thing. And then by the end, they're mad. Anyway, in case you're all wondering why I'm talking about Homestuck, someone DM'd me midstream asking about Homestuck, and I answered them. And they were like, you're streaming. Why are you answering this? I'm like, I've always got time for Homestuck. Uh, let's banish Balancer Lord. Oh, wait. Balancer Lord is crazy, right? Banishing Balancer Lord is bad. Let's banish Backup Secretary. They asked if I had read it, and then they asked if I liked Homestuck 2. And the answer is yes. Of course I like it. I have good taste. I don't know what to tell you. Can I just fire the invo again? Oh no, I have to have it. And I do not have it anymore. Alright, let's make it happen. Pow. Bada bop. Pow. When are you going to play Pester Quest for a variety stream? Never. I'm a one visual novel kind of guy. And it's Ace Attorney. Alright, we did it again. God, this is so easy. This deck is just free wins. Pretty terrible hand, but that's no excuse. GG, MBT. Uh, I think I went first. Uh, that, that's the excuse. I went first. Uh, get owned in the die roll screen. Have you played Psycholonials? If so, what did you think? I have it down. I downloaded it two days ago. I haven't had a chance to play it yet. Master Duel came out, obviously. But I'm very excited for it. I've heard uh, very good things, and I've heard very bad things from people whose opinions I really disagree with. So I'm extremely excited. All right, let's run that shit back, DJ. Um, do we want to run that shit back, DJ, or do we want to do like a little solo mode? Let's do just a little solo mode. I'll show off the deck first. So this is where we are right now. I'm not disliking it. Uh, I, uh, I'm i still not sold on Develgus. But I can see theoretically why we need him. I would like to cut a Lopter. I don't know what I'd cut it for, though. I just like everything else in here. Maybe like a Vanities. Tiku is not bad in this deck. I don't know about Judgment. The card's only good going first. Massively disagree. Mm. Let's try Vanities. I think Judgment's crazy because most of the time, uh, if you're going second, you opened Maxi. And then you get to go first anyway. <laughs> uh...
I'm Phoenix107. Thank you. Because of three face off, three wavering eyes, three electrum, and astrograph, Draco pals are actually playable. Ooh, I would love to play Draco pal. I gotta start playing some electromite decks. It's just been so long since I played the fucking card. Are you gonna play the new We Were uh We Were Here game that you played with Coder in the Subathon? It comes out in March. Man, I someone has the footage for We Were Here Together. That was so much fun. The one I played with Coder. No, we're not playing the fucking Chirinui one. We're gonna finish up the uh the Warriors of the Six Elemental Lords. Finally hit Plat 1 playing Eldritch like a loser, and I gotta say, Destiny Hero Dystopia is a much better normal summon than Inspector Border. I totally agree. It's weird because when we went back and we played the prequel to them, I was just struck at how bad it was. <laughs> I definitely went... Oh my god. Oh my... Oh my god. What are we supposed to do here? I'm going to banish a light in the dark. Oh, my God. 200% dad. Thank you for the sub. Okay, we could do this. Uh, we're going to add Lapitula Mana. Uh, we're going to send Nalu. And I don't fucking care. My Makani. What does this one do? Spell trap is activated? Holy shit. Alright, I'm done. Sure. Creature swap. I'll negate that. Looking for a new deck to play as Dark Magician doesn't do so hot. Any other suggestions you would say that's similar to play? Similar to Dark Magician? Uh, Subterror? Uh, sheesh, I don't know. Similar to Dark Magician. Invoked? Uh, I'm gonna cycle here. We'll grab Molehu. Uh, I mean, let's just go to combat, right? Boom. Bada bop, pow. Oh! Your next turn. Not this turn. I thought it was skip the battle phase of this turn. It's your next turn. I guess I'm stupid. Fuck you! Oh my god! Had Duster too. Saving Harpies for next game. This isn't lethal! I'm gonna... I'm gonna come. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. This is a good one. What are we making? Fucking Gachi Gachi Gun Tetsu? Cerberus. We'll tribute it. I think we've got one more in deck. Yeah. This guy.
Boom. Windrose. Wait, that's enough. We win the game. Uh, how many wins do we have in grave? One. Two. Okay. We'll go three. Wind. Four. Wind. That was actually five. I did not count correctly. Boom. Boom. Oh, I should have activated the effects of the wind guys. We could have had lethal this turn. Yeah, we definitely could have. Oh my god. So frustrating. Farfa, what about him? What about him? All right, we win. Okay, now watch this. Ready? This time, Monster Reborn. It was Deal of Phantom. Kill this... Mr. Electric, kill this boy! You like that Farvo dude? No, not a big fan. I don't know who the fuck that is. Oh, is Farfa stealing what I was gonna- Oh, is Farfa watching, um... Like, his local or something? Is he doing a little local? Is that what's happening? You doing a little local? You doing just a little bit of a local? Is that what's happening? You make a little bit of a local? You watch any Fargo? What the fuck? What? They give you this? I mean, I'm going to try my hardest. What's this extra deck looking like? Penis? Tell me it looks like penis? Alright, I can win with this. I'm actually good on, like, all of you. Alright, there we go. Not only am I, am I good on, like, all of you, uh, I, I'm a genius. Molehu into Swap Frog. Okay, into Treeborn. Into Battle Phase, into Blazing Mirror Force. All right, good start. Set two pass, you got it. Oh, what are we at? Two? Ooh, we're about to be a little farther. Three, four. We go... Oh my god, we can do it this turn. Okay, we just have to, like, not hit... Uh, Drowning. Take five. LMAO. Pyro X. Okay, that does literally nothing. Combat. 19. Oh my god, we hit the only good one in the drowning. To 28. Okay. We summoned a vanilla? Yeah, but he's got 2800. Oh, good. The best card in our deck. That's crazy. We can tribute summon him. I don't know what you all are talking about, chat. That was easy. That deck was great. If you lost with this, you're just bad. I don't know what to tell you. Like, get good. Like I, like I am. I opened fucking... <laughs> that hand was... <laughs> that hand was Shell, Shell, Scattershot, and we won. <laughs> because the other two cards were Blazing Mirror Force. Oh, I got the Element Saber La, La Paluia Mana NFT. That's great. <sighs> Did you see this, by the way? That they're rolling out NFT avatars on Twitter and they're going to be hexagons? What an incredible... Wh that's just so smart. They're literally just putting a badge on people's... Like, literally just putting a mark on people's fucking Twitters. Yeah, this user is a fucking dumbass. Feel free to disregard. It's just, like, 
Oh, man. Didn't you ever watch an after-school special about bullying? Come on. Don't you know where this is going? All right. Here we go. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna do something a little bit different uh, for the next little bit, and uh, I'm stealing this directly from Danny. If Danny's here, I'm sorry, uh, I am stealing it. But we're gonna use the oft unused spectate function to live cast some random duels that are going on. Give me ten seconds. All right, Rebby, you got it. All right, here, hold up, hold up. Let me let me watch this clip that was just sent to me about NFTs while we were doing this. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Here, let me. Yeah, I I I I, I jumped in. I know. I heard. I'm I, so happy I taught you what they were. You did. You taught me what's <laughs> up, and then I bought an ape. I got an ape too because I saw you on the show with people and you said you got a moon pay, so I went and I copied you and did the same thing. You did? Mm-hmm. This is your this That's is your my <laughs> Something's going on here, right? Like that that's not how real humans speak and act. What's going on? It it's not it does it didn't even look like they were reading off a script. It looked like they were like they were in hell. <laughs> All right, okay, 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 okay. Here we go. <laughs> that was that was uncanny. All right, chat. It's time to use one of the least used. Okay, but let me let me do a better intro. This is gonna be a better intro. Hey everybody, Joseph Rothschild here, aka MVT, and today we're stealing content. Now usually we steal content from Farfa, from Coder, from Simo, from Hardleg, from APS, from. Pretty much everyone, I think. But today we're stealing content from Danny. The content Ouroboros now has reached its final form. We are going to be using, in Master Duel, one of the least used features. Now, for those of you that don't know, Master Duel shipped in a weird, unfinished state and is missing a lot of the stuff that people were expecting. But one thing it's not missing is the ability to spectate duels. Now, I don't mean your friend's duels. See, that would make too much sense. Uh, instead, I mean random fucking duels. You can just jump in and spectate. So we're gonna we're gonna live cast a couple of these, and uh, we're gonna have a prediction up, and you're gonna you're gonna uh, guess if duelist A or duelist B is gonna win. So here we go. This is not toss. What? It's <laughs> just a random duel. Okay, so <laughs> it would appear Duelist A, we don't know what they're on, but Duelist B is on what appears to be Sacred Beast. All right, here we go. Of course it's Blue Eyes. Stop saying Chaos Max, he's not playing it. Chaos Form immediately met with a solemn judgment. I mean, you've got to stop that. So we've got two duels that are off to the goddamn races out of the starting gate. After that, we'll trade in. We can expect the last card in hand is Chaos Max. Looks like we're going to the end phase, and we're going to activate Embodiment of Apophis at end of main, because for some reason this card says end of main. The second Fallen Paradise, the draw. We're going to have to go for the uh, Magic Planter here. Magic Planter sending the Embodiment. Holy guacamole, we're one continuous trap away. All right, Bingo Machine go, the activation, and Summon Limit coming down now. You see, the thing with Summon Limit is you never want to wait till the second one. And the thing with Imperial Custom is you always want to fire Imperial Custom. All right, let's let's see what happens here. Blue Eyes. Whoa, whoa, what were those cards? Excuse me? The True Light and the Ultimate Creature of Destruction. Oh, the Harpy's Feather Duster coming down. Unfortunately, not a continuous trap. Come on, one more. <gasps> That's it. That does it. Okay, we HFD the back row. We were passing. Buddy, you have Uriah. You have Fallen Paradise. Just go for it. Oh, my God. Okay, we're going to go return of the Dragon's Shrine. Gonna bring out Blue Eyes White Dragon. We're gonna get in for three. Oh no, we're going into Azure Eyes Silver Dragon, the best nine synchro. There's not a better one. 
We're going to activate skill drain in response. That's actually pretty killer. Uh, we are not dead here. But we got to go for Uriah on the crackback. Wait. What? Okay, we'll, we'll simply tribute the skill drain. Oh, this is perfect. Yes! Uriah hits the field. 4,000 attack. Two off Fallen Paradise, including a Tiki Soul. Setting Thunder King Ryo! <laughs> oh my god. We literally, we can't have him at attack position. We'll die. Azure Eyes activates here, bringing back a Blue Eyes. That's fine. Main one. Normal Manju. Solemn Manju. Oh, you better hope he doesn't just have it. Here we go. Draw two more cards off Fallen Paradise. We're, this game is rapidly sh Oh my god. Skill Drain and Tiki Curse. Summon Tiki Soul. Flip Ryo. Bujiti Sukiyomi! The okay, this deck is actually based. <gasps> Soul and Curse! We're literally winning this game. Wait, we're actually going to win this game. Oh my god. Okay, okay. So Soul and Curse is a pop. Uh, but unfortunately, they're effect monsters, and I believe these count as effects, so they don't operate under skill drain. I'm not sure. Azure Eyes bring back the Bood just as a blocker. Mandrew with the 10,000 hands coming down. We can't stop it. AVR. Oh my god, it's time. AVR. Send a Blue Eyes. Stop saying Chaos Max. He's not playing it. Battle phase, attack. We can't afford the skill drain, and we die! Oh my god. That was a crazy one. Wow. I never thought... Wow. Sacred Beast with their bad Blue Eyes matchup. That was incredible. Alright, what's up next? Another Blue Eyes player. How do we keep finding these? They have the Ritual Raven pet. All right, so they're going to start with Bingo Machina Go Go, baby. Uh, blue Eyes, Blue Eyes, I'm Blue Eyes. I guess they're getting alt here, probably. Yep. Gengar TV, thanks for the sub. Hey, good to hear. They'll go for Sage. And Herald of Orange Light coming down, pitching Herald. All right, is it Drytron or is it like a bad deck? What do you think? And pass. It's Drytron. Okay, Diviner of the Herald coming down, sending Herald of the Arclight. Herald of the Arclight effect. Gonna add a copy of Ben 10 to hand. We just need one name, and this is the entire combo. That's a name. Oh, that's like the worst name it could be, though. Uh, we'll trigger the effect of the Ben 10 here. We're gonna get a copy of Ben 10. Uh, we need another name really badly. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, so should have fired it. Gamsiel coming down. Alt's going to pop the card. We're going to normal summon a copy of Whitestone. Down comes Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon into a Solemn Judgment. Drytron playing Solemn Judgment. You know, if there's one thing that Drytron needed, it was more Omni Negates. And Solemn Warning for the Return of the Dragon Lords. Please just normal summon a fucking Inspector Border and win the game. Okay. So we've got White Stone of Ancients. Uh, we're going to activate it, putting... Oh my god, this is it. Wait, this is it! They're dead! Wait, they're fucking dead! <laughs> Get absolutely pumpstered and dumpstered, dude. Drytron in shambles. And the, <laughs> the doubters were rewarded why would you ever bet against blue eyes white dragon blue eyes now two and oh in spectate duels all right let's jump in i'm gonna again. banish a light in the dark grunt life thanks for the prime any primers in chat oh orcust we have not seen orcust yet all right, so we're going to begin with Einsatz, the best Orcist card. Normal Skeleton Dogman, so already a better player than Farfa. Pitch the Dogman, activate Mothman, pitch the Mothman, American Sniper. Thankfully, Mothman still does it. Draw Solemn, pitch Nightmare, activate Nightmare, use Nightmare to get, I think, Harp from deck? Yeah, Harp into Grave. We'll activate Harp, we'll get, I don't fucking care, Gearsu. Gearsu effect, we're going to bin on Symbol Skeleton. Uh, these two to the Grave, we'll go ahead and grab Galatea. We'll trigger the effect of Galatea, we'll go ahead and get the Field Spell, I'd imagine. Could be the 
Yep, we're getting the counter trap. Okay, crescendo pass. Activate symbol skeleton here. We're going to bring back the gear suit. Uh, we're going to make ding. Oh, no. Nope. Long gear suit pass. That seems pretty good. That seems, uh, that, uh, that, uh, whoa. I don't know about this one. What is that? Molten Conduction Field, the activation, followed up with Laval Handmaiden, followed up with Handmaiden, followed up with, what is this, Magma Cannon into Rising Fire. What the fuck? That's going to eat the crescendo. Now what? Okay, uh, the Laval to pop the unknown, normal summon cannon, cannon effect to special, Einsatz chains to send an Orcus to the grave, but it doesn't really matter, right? Uh, okay, cannon effect, special back, little handmaiden, lady, go to Salamander, uh, Salamander effect, draw two cards, send two cards, including a handmaiden, trigger the handmaiden, send a cannoneer, activate rekindling! <gasps> Oh my god! The, oh my god, they're fucking popping off. As many? I thought it was three. Rhoda. Grab Boost Warrior. Uh, is this the end of the game? Uh, TG. Oh my god. This is so based. Formula Synchron. Draw two cards. One off the Hyper Library and one off the Formula. Oh my god. <laughs> Monster Reborn the draw. Bring back Handmaiden. Do we have a tuner? She's a tuner, of course. Laval Dragon. Target one card your opponent controls. Return it to the hand. Uh, we're going to target the Long Gearsu, I'd imagine. And now can we start linking? Oh, no. That's not once per turn. Einsatz back to the hand, too. All three... For shooting Quasar! Combat! Boom! Boom! Oh my lord! That was the most inc- That's inc- Where are we finding these? These are so based! Oh my god! <laughs> wow! Clearly, I'm playing the wrong games. Where do I find these duels? All right, next predict up. Let's do it again, baby. All right, three bangers in a row. Clearly, we've got to have a stinker eventually. MBT has a nice bussy. Devil Deville, thank you for the five. SPS would be so proud of that Laval player. Oh, boo. All right, Thundra time. We're going to go... Oh! Yep, well, you know, that's this is kind of the prerequisite to playing any Yu-Gi-Oh game now is one player activates Maxi and we just see if we have it out. Statistically, it's more likely to draw the out to Maxi than Maxi, so it's not that big of a surprise. Dark here, go ahead and get a uh, Thunder Dragon Matrix. We'll go for... Allure, Banishing Dark, Triggering Dark. We'll add from deck to hand. What a fusion. Yeah. Normal Black Dragon, Chaos Space, Pitch of Thundra. Grab... Oh, the Dark Creator. Okay. Oh, we're going in this Striker Dragon. Trigger Black Dragon, Collapse Serpent for white. Special white. Trigger Chaos Space, put back black. Duo, the ad here. We'll go for Cross Sheep. Trigger white for black. TD Fusion here? Going for Chaos Creator. Chaos Creator effect. Looks like Thunder Dragon Dark, the Roar the Special, rather. There's Kahlo. Cross Sheep effect, Matrix effect. How far are we going here? Summon Ash Blossom? Summon Ash Blossom. Just make an Apo. Sure. Trigger Thunder Dragon. Get another Thunder Dragon. Fusion. Put back the Thunder Dragons. Or Titan. Uh, and then pass turn. So we have the Matrix as a quick and Kahlo and Apo for three. 
Lightning Storm the start. Uh, that gets rid of the Apo. We'll go Ray and Rose. What? What? Chocanine here. That triggers Titan. Why would you not summon it to the EMZ? Yeah. That's got to be all she wrote. We just summon Duo here. Now oh, they're really going for it. No need. Oh, we might as well pop the back row. Judgment. What are they doing? This is lethal on its own. Sorry, striker player. That one was a little cringe, not gonna lie. Vas is next. Sidra. Okay, what the fuck is this card? Okay, uh... Engage into Mecha Multi Roll into Area Zero. Must be nice to have everything. All right, Ray here for Kagari. Kagari add back Engage. So this is actually a hilariously good matchup for Sidra. What? 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 What is going on? What? We are literally just clicking buttons. All that, and we don't even have three for the Ngage. Decent turn one. Decent turn one, I will say. A pretty good turn one from the Sidra player. Oh, my God. See, I mean, this is what happens when you open this many pieces of, uh, of interruption. Is Well, I mean, they've turned off fucking Cyber Dragon, so we're going to rev system it out. Uh, I guess we will Cybernetic Fusion Plant. Power Bond. Oh, fuck. There's Rampage. Rampage is going to eat the board here. We'll trade for the Widow Anchor. There's not enough engrave to take it. We're just dead here. We're just literally dead. Oh, we're not dead because uh, we only get one attack. Alright. This is the two uh, stupidest motherfuckers on the planet. Of course we're playing two. Oh, we're playing Unicorn. You have lethal. Time to go time to go into the battle phase. That was not a good game. Not a good game. Alright, let's run that shit back. My boy! This is what I'm fucking here for, baby. Oh, yeah. How'd they get this trophy? They're level 19. They've been playing for a million years already. All right, Striker. Effect into Hayate. We chain Maxi here every time, yeah. Why not go into Hayate here? Oh, because of the the maxi. Oh my god. This is crack. Alright, here we go. <sighs> Three down. We just pass on one day of peace, right? Oh my god. Maybe we don't. Chicken game is weird. You can't respond to chicken game. <gasps> So you can't, like, fortune? Holy shit. 
There's no way, right? 29 cards? No fucking shot. <laughs> There's no fucking shot, dude. So you pop the chicken game here if you're the striker player for sure. Whifferoni. Yeah. Hayate. Jammers. We're going to grab back the Engage. We're just looking for like anything that stops a draw here. Adding Hornet Drones, maybe that does something. Uh, just filling up the grave, too, in case you find a uh, an Avarice. Kinda to gain life. Summon Rose. What are we doing here? Shizuku. Battle phase. Oh my god, they had not read one day of peace. Oh no. No, come on. Not like this. What the fuck is that? What is fusion? Maxi? <gasps> Revealing sandwich. Reveal sandwich. <gasps> Infip witch! Oh my god, it doesn't it doesn't work! Oh my god, it doesn't work! You're fucking doofus! You lost to a 28 cards left in decking Zodia player! Oh my god! <laughs> oh wow! Where are they finding these replays? Oh my god. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, Infernity's decent, but uh, I don't think you want to be uh, drawing four monsters. What the fuck is this? Okay. Okay, I'm with you. I'm with you. Summon a Synchron with a different level. Okay, Junk Synchron. Trigger Jet. Pitch. What is that? Rush Warrior. Jet. Doppel. Okay. We, we comboing off here. Junk speeder. Speeder chain link one. Will we go for doppel? We will. Doppel chain link two. Okay, so this does not have the new Stardust stuff, so it's a little weaker than it would be, but it does have Jet Synchron. Whoa, Road Synchron. Wow, we're really hurting. The Krabby Patty Secret Formula Se Synchron. Stardust Charge Warrior. Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. Okay, that is not a frightening board. All right, you can do this, Infernity guy. Just draw any Ignite. <laughs> I'm so sorry. This is, <laughs> this is terrible. Oh, no, this does it. This does it. Ash here. Fuck. Okay, this doesn't do it. That's fine. We can do it next turn. We can do it next turn. Okay, summon junk or add junk synchron. Normal junk synchron. Trigger junk synchron. We have Doppel Warrior and Grave. Summon Doppel. Special satellite synchron. TG Hyper Librarian on turn three. Doppel Warrior for two tokens. Two, three, four, five, six. Satellite. Make it four. X Saber Wayne. Hyper Librarian Wayne. There's no way. This is so bad. <laughs> this deck is so poopy. Special Doppel. Jet Synchron. Pitch Quillbolt. Oh my god. Armory Arm. Hyper Librarian. What, what the fuck is this? 11? 10? Satellite? Oh my god. It's not even lethal! <laughs> I 
I feel bad for that player. They definitely should have won. <laughs> this is so much fun. Holy shit. It is weird watching Synchron players innovate in the wake of no Stardust anything. Oh, what? Yo, they have an Ultra Rare. Okay, Chaos Space. You probably ashed this, right? Valkyria here. It looks like some sort of chaos deck, but wolf is so strange. Put the wolf back. Normal Raiden. Raiden effect. BLS. Didn't even activate Raiden. You ash this for, for sure. Yeah. That was three summons. Okay. Okay. See what we can do. We drew Rescue Cat. Dog Rat. There he is! The Party Boat! Okay, Party Boat here for Rat. Rat effect. Uh, bring back Rat. Uh, these two for, yeah, Zen Maintenance. Trigger Zen Maintenance. Add a wind up. We get Factory. Activate Factory. We have Bat in Hand. We have Zen Maintenance on field. Zen Maintenance effect for Rat. Factory trigger. We get Shark. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. Rat effect. Yup, yup, yup. Oh, bring back Zen Maity. I don't know about that. Uh, shark effect. Special Shark. Shark effect. Go to three. Two for what? Zen Phantom Knights of fucking Breaksword. <gasps> Wait, Zen Maity has an effect. Oh, as does uh, Zen Maintenance. All right, let's go. Equip to Zen Maity. Zen Maity effect. Holy shit. Summon the bat from hand, bat effect, summon back the rat, or add back the rat, rather. These two to the grave for UFD. Okay, this is, um, this is based as fuck. My god. This is exceptionally based. Set infip pass. Did not set the infip. Said, ah, eh, fuck it. Chaotic ruler, that's fine. Banish two, there he is. Trigger Valkyria. Yep. Send Lumina. Chaos Space again. You ash this for sure. Yeah. Uh, Chaos Space second effect. Return Valkyria? Yeah. Draw. Reborn off the freaking top. Lumina. One card in hand. Go to combat. Attack in. Nope, that's it. Wait, no end phase Lumina effect? What? Why? Huh. Rat for rat. Trigger. How do we still have targets for factory? Oh, we have an additional shark in deck. Zen maintenance. Zen maintenance effect. Shark effect. Based Willy, we asked him to be the commencement speaker at our high school graduation in like 2011. He declined. Valk says you can't use its effect. I see. Alright, we're just making access code here. What a sad end to a really based game. Boom! Windups, kind of killer. Not gonna lie. All right, let's let's uh let's run it back, G. Should access code be banned for being boring? For a long time, I was in favor of a Boral Sword ban, not because the card was good, but because it was boring as fuck. Stop saying Chaos Max. He's not playing it. Are we just making Chaos Max pass? Oh. <laughs> At least some an alternative, too. We're just literally making Chaos Max pass. What? What are, what are we doing here? Oh, man. Duelist B, tell me you've got a plan for this. This is actual bronze. Let's go! Kaleido Chick Panther Dancer. Polly, wait! He's dead! He's dead! 
Yellow Martin Trigger. We grab Polly back off the Kaleido Chick. Black Sheep Trigger, we get Polly to hand. I don't know what the fuck Black Sheep's Graveyard Effect is. Oh, you get the monster I'm gonna back. Banish a light Based Willie, thank you for the gifted sub. Here we go. Reveal Polly. Yellow Martin Resolution. Grabbing Serenade Dance. Perfume. Oh my god. This is crazy. Perfume pitching Serenade Dance. I'm gonna banish a light in the dark. Or pitching Polly. I mean, who cares? Wolf. How are we doing in Grave? We can make a second Leo Dancer. <sighs> and Based Willie, thank you for the second Gifty as well. Leo Dancer outs this board. Combat into Blue Eyes. Trigger the effect. Pop all special summoned monsters. Oh shit. Uh oh. Wait, we don't have it out to Chaos Max! Wait, shit! <laughs> uh oh. Or, wait, what does Serenade Dance do? Nothing. How the fuck do we out Chaos Max? We're gonna find out. Panther Dancer? Serenade Dance to give it 500. Kaleido Chick. How the... F what are we doing here? Oh, we are just going to try and kill the token. That's our win condition. <gasps> it wasn't big enough! It got to 38! No! <laughs> But we can make another. Serenade Dance. Another token. Pass it back. All right, our win con is the token. <laughs> token of defense. Oof. All right, what does piercing in this deck? Wolf again. Banishing Panther Dancer. We can make Cat. Yeah. Serenade Dance. Kaleido Chick. Another token. Blue cat. Cat cat. Combat. Whoa! What? It got huge! How did it get so big? Blue cat's graveyard effect? No. Blue cat doubles attack when specialed. Holy shit. Oh my god. Easy. This is so... I'm never playing Yu-Gi-Oh! again. This is too... It was Serenade Dance. <laughs> Who won that? Uh, the Luna Light player. Player B. Oh, boo. I'm going to banish a light in a dark. Boo hoo. Nets quick. Thank you for the sub. Cool, Old Lich. Dude, that rocks. Oh, that's so sick. Old Lich? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, my God. I love it. Okay. Nope. That's, that is not one. Polly here. We send Penguin for sure. Penguin Scythe. Make Whale. Oh, we're making Kraken. Penguin. Ooh. Kraken. Send Lich. Skill Drain. Oh, this is a really fun match. Skill Drain Eldritch. That's so sick. Do you think anyone's ever thought about doing that before? Oh, not going for the bear effect in Grave. What the fuck is this? No. No. No.
Alright, we're dead here. This is lethal if we have the gun. <laughs> Fluffles go crazy, man. Oh, it's not even lethal because of the fucking skill drain. If we have a walk, it's lethal. It's not even lethal then. Okay, toy vendor. Conk. Whoa! That's incorrect! Whoa, that's very incorrect. Okay, come on. One time punish. Sabers. Nope. Sometimes you play the monkey and sometimes the monkey plays you. This is what Fluffle always looks like to me. No, I, I swear this never happens. All right, let's get one more and then we'll play some games again. How's that sound? Bum, 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 bum. Toy vendor. How did we get Fluffle again? I don't understand. How did we get it again? Uh, Solar Sail FTL, we actually just saw one. That's Fluffle, baby. Kraken Pass. Why would you do this? What are- wait, what are we doing? What- wait, what the fuck? Just making the biggest fucking Dryden in the seven seas. <clears throat> All right, there she is. Edge Imp Scythe. Okay. So Scythe resolves. I was gonna say on resolution there's a Scythe engraved, but no, they're using they're using it on field. All right, we'll take four here. Second main, we can go into Zeus. Should not have set that fucking Solemn Judgment. Huge mistake. And then we'll just pass turn. Raigeki. No! <laughs> Solemn Judgment, my guy! Why? What is going on? Why is everyone here a monkey? I don't understand. Oh, I just don't get it, chat. I've never seen this card in my life. Fright for Daredevil? This is the worst card I've ever seen in my life. Oh my god. We don't have any more Zoo Xyz, and we didn't set the... Why did we not set the MST? What are you getting out of saving the MST? Oh, thank the Lord. Get owned. Oh, get owned. Thoroughblade beats. Oh! You're fucking with me. There's no way you do this in this order. There's no way you do this in this order. Oh my god. Please just set the MSP. We're still gonna win. 
a fantastic duel from both players. Played epically. That was a really good one. That was a really good one. Okay, here we go. One more, one more. I'm so glad we picked one more. Oh! <laughs> Okay, so we go Rescue Rabbit, A Cell Recombination Device, Stealth Buster Effect, A Counters on Alien Mars. So that does not do what you want because it banishes for cost, but we do have Rescue Rabbit, or we do have Ash Blossom. So now what? Now they pass. All right, we're doing it. We're, get, we're getting in. <laughs> Off the top, baby! Off the freaking top. Let's go. Recombo into Kid. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, we tribute uh, the alien Mars for Curse. Curse effect. Uh, we'll bring back uh, Naoya. Uh, now you gotta play Ogadotic Water Lily. Uh, we're gonna send another one of these fucking shitty cards to the grave. We'll special Ogad Abyss. Uh, we'll special summon back Nunu. Uh, these two to the grave. We're gonna make Alien Shock Trooper M Frame. Uh, we're gonna go for Alert. We're gonna tribute the last one of these. Is this lethal? It is not. Uh, we're gonna shuffle these back. Uh, put them back in the grave. We'll trigger, what is this, Zoha uh, to put it in hand. We'll trigger Stealth Buster to put A counters on our monster. Normal Zoha. Is this lethal? Okay. This was epic. <laughs> that was epic. <laughs> What a what a poo poo deck. <laughs> that was so bad. Oh, do we get money for that? Destroy the card in ranked duel. Destroy the card in ranked duel. I want the boxing glove so bad. <laughs> oh, Coder's doing a tournament. I should play in Coder's tournament. What would I play in Coder's Tournament? Probably Synchron Lich. I wouldn't want to stream it, though. Yeah, I wouldn't want to stream it. How about this? Signups are full? No, he'll make room. I'll make him make room. Uh, I might not, though. I do have stuff to do today. A mechanic coming by and fixing my car. The journey to get my car registered in the state of Maryland has been literally a nine-month affair. All right, tell you what. Uh, I'm going to play one more four of with viewers uh, with this generator deck, and then I'll call it for the day. We'll, we'll have been live for about four hours. That's about how long I want to go. Yeah. All right, I'm going to take a piss real quick. I'm going to play an ad, and then I'll be back. I'm going to banish a light in the dark. <laughs> Dr. Strange Jove, thank you for the sub. Gifted to Tetra Gamer. All right, we're going to go duel. Free room. We're going to create a room. We're going to put four people in it, and we're going to create it. Here's the details of the room. Jump on in, folks. And if you've already been in today, you know, do, do let someone else jump in.
Bow, bow. Oh, new history of jank out. Sick. Oh, this one sucks. Countless champions. Simo plays the worst deck I've ever seen in my entire life. It looks like the top comments are about why did you copy paste all the co-hosts at the end instead of watching the co or the patrons at the end instead of watching the co-hosts get mad about them. All right. We probably got four people in here now. Yeah. All right, Yoror, let's go. Joseph, can you stop filming on Thursday nights? Thanks. I'm not. The only time I film on Thursday nights is when I have to film with RJ. Whew. Whew, almost missed that. Oh, Tuesday nights. Why? Did Danny ask you to say that or something? We were going to make Danny stream. I'm no. I'm going to banish a light in the dark. Fragswell, thank you for the sub. I mean, we could do any night. I had no, we couldn't. We really could only do... I was like, we, we don't have to do Tuesday. And then I was like, nope, there's a reason we do Tuesday. Because Monday and Wednesday, I'm streaming until 11 p.m. Uh, Thursday, I either go to locals or film with RJ. Friday, I would like one night to spend with my wife a week. Danny's dream career over. Why? He still gets everything he wants. Okay, so... The point of Dovelgus is like it prevents you from these like scenarios where you accidentally draw it, but then or where you uh, you draw too many of the bosses, but then sometimes you draw it, so that sucks. Uh, this is fine. This is a great start. Next turn we can Lopter, use Lopter to shuffle back Dovelgus, and we're like fine. But where will I react to auction series now? Generator boss stage just activated, chain another Carter effect. Yeah, let me just fucking negate my own generator boss stage. Uh, we're going to get Lopter here because we have the Macaba. We have a little bit of insurance. At least uh, Dovelgus is an Earth, so you confuse him for Malangancia. Are you talking about the limited to one card in, uh, <laughs> in Duel Links? That card could come off, right? Loving your content for about a year now. Love the new SMD series too, LMAO. Oh, thanks. This will probably be on there. Ooh, this sucks. Stop saying Chaos Max. He's not playing it, chat. This is Generator Invoke, yeah. Is there a link to the deck? Uh, I'll put the deck up when I feel comfortable with it. Uh, I can show it off after this, but it still needs some tuning, I think. I think, wow, I just love playing Called by this format. My god. It's just like not only is called by really good at stopping exactly Maxi, it's also like fucking solemn judgment a lot of the time. Just free solemn judgment. What's the stop saying Chaos Max joke? It's a classic meme from Distant Coder Stream. Ooh, I'm about to have a heart attack. Give me a Oh, feeling like Metal Gear Solid 5 over here. I've got the Phantom Pain. It's a pain that started in my arm and it's getting, it went up to my jaw. Ugh. I got blood taken too yesterday. I hope it's not a clot. 
this is fine. I have no problem with this. Yeah, I do need some water, I think. Oh, okay. Now I feel good. Candle's fine. Uh, we maybe should have negated Candle, now that I'm thinking about it. Because <clears throat> if we negate the uh, Inception, then they can just add it back. Oh, this is going to be a hard one for sure. Talismandra pitching what's Megalith? I think I That's very interesting. That's fine because there's not anything good they can get here. The Fey Lake back. Pensaplume target Phalag, right? And now we can cut them off of Phalag by using called by here. <clears throat> we probably can't keep them off ritual summoning entirely, but we can stop the ritual chain from happening. Yeah, so they have something in hand they can go for because Baythor is a quick, I believe. This is hard. This is a hard one. Megalith, good deck. Good deck. Ah, oh, we should have negated the candle. That was a huge misplay. Oh, actually, it didn't matter at all. They have the unformed. Unformed pitching talismandra. They're going to go for a fool here. We have to banish the fool. The only way we get that done is with Makaba. A fool doesn't have an on-field effect, so we'll always be able to do it to the the main phase tribute effect. Aerotron's the quick? Okay, sure. They chain Aerotron here if they have it, if they want to get maximum fool value. Because then they can fool CL1, we Makaba fool CL3. Or we, le uh, we pass Pryo on the first fool and they get to actually resolve it. Fool here to tribute from main deck. Oh, add back that guy? Yeah, that's completely fine with me. Okay, fool effect here. Uh, we have to banish. Uh, we'll lose Develgus here. Oh, we have we have a response window. So we can Aerotron here for the Baythor in hand, sending the Fool. Yeah, dude, that's sick. Unfortunately, we have one additional negate on our side of the field. So if they have something to stop this, then we're fine. Or then we're fucked. But otherwise, we're fine. Yeah, Aerotron negated. Uh, we know Baythor in hand. So, and we know the other card is Incantation Inception. So they do get to Inception here. Baythor for one. And then they can Inception pop the remaining guy. Going to Bookstone. Bookstone adds back Inception, so they might not even be playing it. Baythor for... Oh, it doesn't... It's not just Megaliths. It's anyone. So it's Baythor for two. Wow. God, Baythor is such a good card. Holy fuck. It's got so much ass on him, too. So we've cycled through every other uh, incantation. So it's... Oh, it was, it was just one? No, it's two. Yeah, the negations. Sure. That's not sufficient, though. 
They can Inception here, but it doesn't do anything. I think they actually probably just leave the incantation and attack. Yeah. And just be like, I hope you don't kill it. Man, that was like a god hand for us, and we still almost lost. All right, so we're going to start off with uh, Lopter. Uh, we're going to grab Mardell here. I will go Mardell effect. I uh, will grab Boss Quest. Boss Quest. Pitch Lofter. This deck is sick, but it's not good in ladder. Mine or my opponent's? I think the Megalith is good in ladder. I th it can easily get you to flat. And what are we doing next, chat? Say it with me. Uh, with the knowledge that our opponent is going to put up at maximum one thing we need to negate, I think it's actually better to keep the boss stage up and not commit to... Yeah, not commit to the boss fight as our way to get back into interruption. So we can just age these here. This isn't lethal, but like I would struggle to think of a way that my opponent would out this uh, board. Uh, we'll go Invo back. This was maybe wrong. We should have just done Purgatrio, I think. Uh, what does it want us to go into? Yeah, I was going to say Mascarena probably. Yeah, so they're in this weird position where like none of the incantations exactly work, right? Uh, because you needed incantation plus a ritual thing. It would have to be like desires into something. Like this this deck has a lot of combos, but they're mostly two cards, and they're gonna have to chew through at least one negate from me. Or one unresponsible negate because of the way uh I'm gonna banish a boss room works. J Chase, thank you for the sub. Boss room actually might be a liability though, because it might draw them into stuff. Like this is the problem. All their combos are two card, so I don't want to go for uh, the line where I go for the additional A lister. Uh, let's summon a... Uh, let's just go Har. No reason to fuck around here. Um, I don't want to go for the line where I go into the additional A-lister. And then I uh, have to use... Like, a uh, boss fight to get back into boss room to get into the negation. Because I think the only way I lose this is if they find one of their two-card combos. And, like, I think more important than any of that is just the fact that they don't have anything. Like, wow. That is... And that's a killer draw. That is a killer fucking draw. Uh, not sufficient while I have Har on field. Oh, man. Wow. That was so good. Wow. That deck is horrifying. <laughs> really scary stuff. All right. That oh, looks like these two are playing each other. Alien and D-Rag. Why can't you summon the, def the tokens in defense? Or is it always attack? I believe it's always attack. Oh, they're out. <clears throat> All right, Darog, let's go. Darog, say it. I think I'm going to win this one. Ooh, we are hemorrhaging viewers. Oh, Coder's live. I see. No big deal. We'll host Coder after this. Man, I really want to play in this fucking tournament. Cody's doing the tournament in 20 minutes. That's perfect timing, because that's about when I'm finishing. It's almost like we're You know, it's good for Coder and I to be streaming at different times, I think. Oh, this kind of sucks if they ash this. Come on. I should have gone for this first to give them an opportunity to ash it. We'll try it again next time. No, it's good for Coder and I to be streaming at different times. I don't think we can avoid streaming at different times than Farfa. He just, like, is constantly on. He streams for so long. Although, Coder streamed for fucking 12 hours yesterday. I was like, oh, I'll I'll catch the, the tail end of Coder's uh, stream. And then, you know, I'll stream for, like, six. And then he was just like, nope, I'm streaming for 12 hours today. Crazy. Imagine not watching both streams at the same time. That's true. I've, I've always been saying this.
the non-aggression pact of a uh, Danny and, <laughs> and MBT. Imagine not having four monitors dedicated to Yugi streamers. Yeah, just like watching all four at once to prevent any chance of a thought occurring. If you ash this, I'm gonna be so mad. Oh wow, we have to ash this. This is so many fucking draws. It's two draws. Yeah, we can't do it. It's minimum two draws. We have to ash it. Don't. Okay. I don't think I can go lofter here. I really want to go lofter. Yeah, we we I I think we have to play a little greedy. Like if we get if we get absolutely boneronied. Yeah, if we get absolutely boneronied here, like no big deal. This is not a game that we should be winning, I don't think. It's just difficult. So they get to go to main and they get the first crack at something and if they just like fire off a regeki, we'd like lose. So there's nothing we can do about it. I I honestly want to go back to uh Artemis cuz she's a spellcaster. That's mattered a lot more. Uh Loyal Guanyun. That's interesting. So we actually might be able to do this here. Forbidden Droplet. Sending the A Loyal Guanyun. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, I'll let that resolve. Guan Yun is a 25. Puts him down to a 15. But no problem, because after the Guan Yun summon, we can boss fight. Get another one. The summon is a soft once. So we can do it again. I think we do want to do hard here. Okay. This ain't bad. They're going to want to go to combat here. They can eat our entire negation possibility here. And the two cards in hand to maybe win them the game. But like hard just existing is such a problem for any deck that searches. Right? It means that like of the two cards in hand, one has to be sendable off of Har. Or you have to have no monsters or you never search a monster. Right? It's a difficult line to toe. All right, we're just going for Guan Yu now. It says, fuck it, you know. Cards on the table. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll negate that. Big surprise. Do we have the second Forbidden Dropsies? No. All right, sick. Har is so good against Striker. Yeah, it's insane. It's just unbelievable. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, so we get to go Virtuous Luijan for... Uh, hmm. That is not smart. That is not what I would have done. Because now I get to har it away. <laughs> you had the Raigeki. It's not exactly the Raigeki. Wait, what? Oh my god, let's go! Simultaneous effects go on chain, baby! <laughs> okay, but it doesn't actually work like that, yeah. You 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 it says hander field, so if it's on field it doesn't matter. Okay, bounce with Sun Mao, no problem. Why go into the token here? You would always want to hit Lofter, I feel like. All right, we wow, we win the game here. Uh, we're gonna go grab um, uh, Mardell here. Uh, Mardell effect. Let's go get a uh, boss quest. Boss quest effect for Har. boss fight. Oh, we shouldn't have gotten boss fight. We should have gotten boss room. It doesn't matter. None of this matters at this point. Terra. Keep getting jump scared by the atrocities that are legal in the OCG. Yeah. Fucking vanity's emptiness jump scare right here. 
Magical Meltdown at Alistair. Alistair Effect. I stopped playing this back in 2004. Is it still fun? It's much funner than it was in 2004. Although that's just my opinion. As someone who fucking makes their living playing this stupid game. That's my opinion! Oh. We got one in the grave. Oh, we shouldn't have done that. That was very stupid. Oh, he's a spellcaster. We're fine. Now we make VFD. <laughs> Theoretically, we can. I mean, no reason to. All right, bada bing. All right, we'll set vanities. We'll set boss fight. And I think we have got it. God, Ancient Warriors are so very close. They have like five really good cards. And then there's the rest of the cards. I will say uh, it is way different than it was in 2004. It's much more complicated. Big surprise, right? 20 years of new cards will do that to you. All right, what's the top? What could the top card be to win this game? Desires into... No, I literally do not know. Par. There he is. Wham. Boss stage. Can, you know what? Let's, uh... Oh, they didn't let me flip vanities here. Okay. Sure. They're going to activate the effect targeting itself. <laughs> there you go. Wait, they're letting me keep the vanities? <laughs> yeah. Uh, that was a good one. <clears throat> Alright, last guy. Alien! Let's make it happen. Damn, he's got the car and everything. Ban list today? Of course. Why would there not be a ban list today? What do you, of course there's a ban list today. I told you a week ago. That's only a week away. Fuck, that's probably GG Omega LOL. Oh, no, bro. Oh, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. We got to find, we got to find our dumbass, um... There's a couple of draws that get us out of this. Provided our opponent has literally no interaction. <laughs> oh no. Oh god, okay. I hope this does it. <laughs> this has to resolve or we lose. Oh, thank god. It's. <laughs> It's Develgus time, baby! <laughs> oh my god. We should have gotten Lopter. I there's no reason to. <laughs> Toy vendor shit!
Imagine a world where imperm to Velgas. That's why we waited. <clears throat> there we go. Okay, toy vendor is fine. They're gonna fire toy vendor, and we're gonna chain up Garda. That's our only out here. It's our only interaction. If they pitch something crazy, wings, shit. All right, that's fine. Please do not negate this. I need this to resolve, please. Woohoo! All right, no second toy vendor. Inshallah. Inshallah, no bear. Fuck! <laughs> All right, well, you know. <laughs> we, uh, we tried our hardest here. Okay, whiff. One time whiff, please. One time whiff. What's plan B? You're about to see it, buddy. Okay, this is fine. We're still okay. They got they got two cards in hand. They got wings and grave. They're going to draw what? Four? We should have we should have uh, banished the toy vendor before they could send. They're literally going up to five here. Fucking hell, dude. Well, oh, what is that emote? That's so cool. Kaka. Right, here we go. Fuck! I was... <laughs> God damn it! I was trying to do it on res! <laughs> Alright, no big deal. We'll just draw like 8 cards here instead of 10. I, I need to stop trying to get cute with Maxi. I need to just be like, alright... Maxi has to win us the game. We have no other option outside of Maxi to win this game. It's Maxi or bust, baby. What, what was that? Did you see that? Everything like flickered for a second. Okay. And these are decent cards. He's taking the challenge. Uh, we may not be taking the challenge, actually. We may be just going, uh, dice lock me. Yeah. That's fine. I think we can beat the scythe lock. Poly scythe. Oh, wow. They actually can just stop here. That's an interesting one. Okay. <clears throat> we could just make TK Calamities here. It's called Dark. Just like hard make Calamities right now. actually the play what
Yeah. Uh, we call Dark here, I think. Uh, we can lose at Garda. Because the Hala is always going to get it back. <clears throat> Scythe is Dark. Yeah, Scythe is Dark, but it, it's Activate, not Resolve. The thing is, Scythe is going to summon... um fucking whale or something and we need the whale not to resolve i'm gonna banish a light in it why in the music why is the music in this game so good no clue they did not need to go as hard as they did and yet they did and for that i appreciate it octo oh kraken's interesting because we can't out it octo triggers graveyard effects trigger that sucks Wow, that's really bad. That's really okay, let's cross B for three here. Uh, we don't need the second Makaba. Uh, we've got lights abound. Let's do that. I don't really know what we're even looking for. Alistair's decent. Boss quest is an interesting one. Oh, boss quest is very interesting. Boss quest get room fights. We have two interruptions. Let's do that. Can Hala only get spell traps? I have one no-show. Do you want to fill? I, I really do, Coder, but I have a mechanic I have to meet. Yeah, I, I, ah, I really can't, yeah. I'm like thinking, well, maybe I could. No, I can't. You don't fix your own car. Uh, it is a thing I cannot fix. Summons in defense, so no reason, no reason to go in the up guard even. Uh, we walk here for sure. Next time, yeah, for sure. A room, fight, fight, emptiness. Go end phase. Okay, I think we do have this one actually. So Scythe triggers here. Summons. Emptiness is sick here. Yeah. Emptiness is crazy. So they go turn. What? Why couldn't I boss stage there? Hello? Boss stage? Hostage? You just said no. Oh, okay. Well, uh, let's go dark. It was to play around Ash Blossom, chat. Uh, then a res. We're gonna fight, I guess. I didn't want to do this, but whatever. Trigger boss stage. They draw. Trigger boss stage. Grab Har. Maxi here. Okay. I'll room. We resolve. We go, we go. I grab Har here. What the fuck? Why didn't room trigger? Excuse me? Oh my god.
I'm legitimately shocked. I have no idea what we were supposed to do here. All right, 18 cards in hand. You didn't use it. Are you sure I clicked no? I don't think I was given the prompt. I am kind of out of it. Can you derank from plat one? Yeah, you can. Fluffle Bear. Bear activates Toy Vendor from deck. I will... Do I negate that? I think I'm fine with that. He's going to see all three Toy Vendor. You set the second boss fight so you didn't have a discard. Oh, I see. I see how this works. I have to discard a card, right? We Toy Vendor here. Fluffle Wings. We'll chain a Garda here. Targeting Toy Vendor. Then we'll Har on Resolution. Still having a gate? Correct. <laughs> what was that? Say. Uh, do I negate this? No. Okay, polymerization is activated. Chain another Carter effect. Yeah. All right, sick. This was a fun game. I don't know how we out Kraken. Oh, no, I totally do. the Kraken. Do we need to? Well, I figured out how. Access code? <laughs> Under vanities, yeah. I'm just going to combat. No reason to, like, fuck around here. damage step, so there's nothing I can do about it. MBT, did you ever do debate before? Like in high school and college, yeah. Way back when. I owned people epic Ben Shapiro style with facts and logic. And fight for Kraken. Oh, right. This has an effect. Uh, hmm. The 
that's fine. What if I negate the vanity's effect? Oh, this is poopy. Okay, here's what we do. Uh, Hala. Uh, send. Hala, right? What's the graveyard looking like? Is the other Har in here? It's not. Hala send Har in that case. So I'm back at Garda. Summon up Garda. Uh, summon the tokens. Chain Maxi. This time I'm boss rooming. Invocation! Crazy! That's our best card in the deck. We've been drawing like pee pee poo poo doo doo ka ka. Go a guard of here. We'll go one two. Get the penguin out of here. A resolution. We'll uh, boss fight. Set the one from grave. Trigger. And we have a Har in, in deck still. Unless they drew an Ash Blossom. There we go. And we just have to negate the polymerization here and we're fine. They have one poly left, I think. One. One poly. And they might have a Fright for a Fusion. That actually would be a big problem. There's the poly. Uh, we'll lose the Utgarda here. They simply do not have Fright for Fusion. It's as easy as that. Fright for Fusion isn't even that scary. They only have... Oh, they have like a million guys in Grave. Yeah. It's horrifying. We have an Alistair. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> there it is. Uh oh. I'm in danger. I don't even have an Alistair in rotation. Oh, they're only doing it for two. So this is Tiger. Oh, it's Whale. Whale here. Pop a card on both sides of the field. That's like not terrible. I have no problem with that. This doesn't out the board. Cruel Whale's Thesis. Whale's an extender. Yeah, but they've been through all three polys. Shock, they're on three. Oh, have they been through all three? Oh, they've been through two polys. I just assumed they were not on three. If they poly here, we are dead. There's Tiger. Repair. Um, okay. Octo. Okay. We don't have cat in rotation, do we? Oh. Clever, clever, clever. They're going to use the scythe to do it. Oh. Fuck. Yep. Things aren't looking great. Things are not looking great. Oh, God. All right, they get to eat Hala here. Wow, that's bad. That's very bad. Uh, 
How many of oh, 12 and extra? They've got everything. Set one. What the fuck do you set in this deck? What on earth is the set card? So the only out we really have is like a way to Alistair. And even that's only sort of an out. That does not do it. I'm going to make them Scythe. Oh. They have a repair in grave, right? I'll still attack here. Oh, this has an effect! Whoa, this has an effect! Well, we deserved that loss. That was a very deserved loss. Whew, that was a fun game. A lot of fun games today, Chad. I'm surprised. Well, that's going to be it for me. Thank you all for stopping by. I had a gay old time. This was a lot of fun. If you are uh, interested in what you see, I would really appreciate a follow. Uh, costs you nothing if you're feeling a little more generous. Exclamation mark socials in chat will take you to my YouTube, uh, my Twitter where I make fun of Yu-Gi-Oh! Hahas, and my Twitch or my Patreon, where you can get advanced entry to the tournaments I run, including one that's coming up this Saturday, the Chala Slime Monthly. It's also got a link to Discord where we all get together and plan this shit. I will be back tomorrow at uh, normal time, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll be live for six hours until 11 p.m., playing a lot more Master Duel and maybe doing some React Lord content as well, uh, depending on what comes out on Wednesday. I'm going to throw you over to my main man, Distant Coder, who is doing a sub-tournament right now. Uh, I think the Swiss has just started, so, um, you know, uh, tell him who sent you. And, uh, bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Goodbye.